host JD. If you're new, please do smash that like button, share, and definitely subscribe. If you're a member of the channel, massive, massive respect to you lot. And how to become a member, please do click the join button. YouTube will help you along the way. All right. Yes, as you saw by the title, we are having more big blows. All right. What are we talking about? We are talking about omissions, um, withdrawals, injuries, and all of those stuffs from D1. All right. The last one, um, I've, I've actually been listed as a withdrawal but we are going to go through everything so we can break it down properly because um, last last reggae boys abroad we had actually explained something and that's why it's always good to be watching these games before we jump to conclusion because remember after that actual weekend Aston Villa versus um, West Ham the first thing I said to you look back at my video all right yes so anyways let me go through it right here so west ham's you west ham west ham united's march international all you need to know let me go through it um after five games in two two weeks west ham united hectic schedule at home and abroad is put on ice as the last oh, last bout of international action before the summer takes center stage um, with hotly anticipated tournaments such as the 2024 UEFA European Championship and the 2024 Copa America on the horizon a host of Amaz heroes will be looking to stake their claim for a place in their country's final squad and I love the way they have worded these things to show you that they do respect these competitions so we don't want to hear speculations on the back because it will be coming in this video and uh, while this month's fixtures featuring a number of extra exhibition matches they are a couple of individuals with plenty to play for with qualifying playoffs and nations league knockouts coming up next coming up in the next few days all right let me continue um right here um who has been called up a total of eight West Ham United players could feature for their senior national side ahead of club's Premier League return away at Newcastle United on Saturday, the 30th of March. Mikel Antonio and Mohamed Kudos have withdrawn from the Jamaica and the Ghanaian, Ghana or the Ghanaian squad, respectively, having been called up by the their countries earlier this month so let me flick this up right as we do talk because this is what we were saying in the last game so Mikel Antonio played 66 minutes scored a goal against Aston Villa but he only played 66 minutes in the first half he dropped on his shoulder and he had he, he was definitely struggling for the entire game and we were saying um I, I we are wondering if that was the situation uh, no, it's going to be a problematic situation because it looks like that was the discomfort made him never stay on the pitch longer. All right. And that's what we reported in that one. But we said that he looked OK. He was walking fine. But obviously it was a shoulder injury. So you can still walk because it, it doesn't really um, kill your legs from walking and such. All right. But to, at this point, we don't know the exact reason or the exact injury. But definitely you must have you must um, have a injury to pull out because obviously you know that the countries have the first rights and these guys they have not talked as if they wouldn't want to send the players it's just what happened and how it looks that's what determine if they're going to send the player kudos um do have niger to play which is a good one because they have the world cup qualifiers coming up so they would love to have that individual in their team so um him not going there showcasing that they're not trying to disrespect jamaica because i know we will hear things like that you know and i don't think that's the actual case it's just football players get injured and all of those stuff i guess you're going to get the information later let me give the persons inside the chat a big up um mp w94 thanks for being here omar fowling mass massive respect J joseph brown big up yourself yes it looks like antonio won't be here um Sher sheridan big up yourself ryan graham active dark 
best car, bless up yourself, triple E, big up yourself, edits, man. And what team do you support? Support Jamaica. All right? Yes. Um, I'm not scared, um, scared, J-A to the world, triple E. Then we have Dwayne Thomas, big up yourself. Um, thanks for being here. Then we have Jack Drummond in the building. All right. So he never completed the game, played 66 minutes, and it never looked like it was because he was tired. It more looked like he was injured or was carrying a niggle um, up on his... Um, top off you know all right that's what i saw in the game and we had said it so that means um at this point that's what i'm going to hold the injury um towards all right yes who would be oh how, how impactful this will be to the jamaica team that's the first question how impactful it will be to the jamaica team and who would you use to replace him because obviously it's an injury and you have a 60 man squad so you should have replacements for that or uh, would was he was um he replaced by romario williams and not necessarily kadama theory let me know all right um three place um we are take this this season okay um alex said up him hand that dropped on yes Moyes never did a chance him but that's what i'm saying that's why i've always told people watch the games because that's how you're not going to mislead people down the wrong road all right because we had talked about it from saturday um was it Saturday? yeah yeah it was Saturday. Oh. nah man i think when was the game let me tell you let me tell you the game because the games are coming so fast all right so what date was this game Saturday or Sunday? I think I think it was maybe Saturday. Yeah, because Saturday... No, I think it was Sunday, you know, man. Because I watched um, Hit and then um, Manchester United after. So it was Sunday. It was Sunday. It was, it, it was Sunday. Yes, it was Sunday, guys. Sometimes I have to get back. Are you guys hearing me? Let me know if you guys are hearing me because it looks like I'm got, having some internet problems up here, which is... Which should not be the case. Alright, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn off the Wi-Fi here. So if anything, it it goes on um the next Wi-Fi. Alright. Uh, well JD, next man up and see if Kadamatiri would come. He would he maybe would be up for starting. Coach is going to have to earn his pay um this Thursday. Um, you're you're a bit in and out. All right, all right. I will I will see if it works because if it doesn't work, I will come off the Wi-Fi and then chip it on the next Wi-Fi right here. All right. Thanks very much for all of you guys are um that's been here, even though I'm having some little challenges. I suspect that Kalamatiri is still in play. Simon had has inside information. Well, if he has inside information, that would be good, and that would mean that he would be playing. You get me? Because Kalamatiri, um, these are the strikers that we have right next up in. Line. Um, jo J Jamal Lo, I think he would have moved up to the main team, at the main starting spot. Uh, at least I thought he would have started, but maybe from a left wing channel. Um, but no, I think he could be the main striker. Um, then you have, then you have um Corey Burke, which they, they seem to like Corey Burke. You have Kaim Pat Dixon, you have Cephas, and you have Romario Williams. To me, Kadama Thierry. Um, none of these guys are clear ahead of Kadama Thierry. So that, that's what I would say. Um, maybe this could be a turnaround because at first we heard people speculating and telling people what they know is the reason why he didn't come, which I know it's almost ballocks. I know that he's actually ballocks, straight up. You understand me? Because it makes no logical sense um, for that to be the case. Because you remember, it's the same man that's trying to go in for the players. Them. So that would be good. All right. And I've, and I've got information and that's not accur accurate. You understand me? Yes. So I'm just hoping that he, he takes it up because a lot of these kids want to take the, 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 the like, like um, um, Omar Hutchinson. Most of these kids want to take steps rather than jump into internationals you know yes because obviously um what you realize with him and omar Hutchinson, both of them are not cemented in first team football so if they do drop off they might drop out like anderson anderson came to jamaica and then he drops out of the, the jamaica the, the national the, the main team um in charlton right after that because the the flights and the hustle and bustle it's not easy to get over 
You understand me? Yes. So when you're younger, it's hard to kind of you get it over over yourself, you know, if you're not from this region um, naturally. So I think it's hard for a lot of these guys to um, balance the book if they're just breaking through. So if, because of that, I will still give them an extra year to figure life out. So if next year Kadamateri is still in this good form, I think it, he will make a decision way more easier way more easier because now we would have been cementing his place in the main team or at least on the bench so um what he would be coming here to do he would be more mature and know how to do deal with certain things and as you know most people talk about his iq as a player but um that still don't um change the fact that he would have been one of the best players actually on this listing so that means he would have been up for starters even with Jamal Lowe in the team, he could be the actual starter as a striker um, right there. Obviously, I know that maybe um, Romario Williams would have been um, preferred due to the fact that he played um, in starting roles before and played the same system. So maybe he would have gotten a nod over him, but he wouldn't be far um, behind. Um, why is the communication so sketchy from the camp? I don't know. Al J um, come in and says, um, chipping in and out still. All right, all right. I will check this right here to make sure it's working good um is cory burke uh, uh in cory burke we trust laugh out loud set up mash up um Aldre, Aldre, one thing i you, you you teach me Aldre, you you don't like jamaica you only like lee and bailey and whisper that's the only two person you support that's what you are showing me right here big boss because they don't business you you your two ballers them never save jamaica never ever save jamaica so how can you work out something? Uh, how can you listen? Listen to yourself, Aldre. Your two ballers, them, not saving Chelsea. Lee and Bailey, yes, I would say Lee and Bailey um, saves uh, Aston Villa sometimes, but the main man saving Aston Villa. All right, but I would give you Lee and Bailey. I would give you Lee and Bailey, but Whisper not saving a fly more than he's trying to save himself from getting uh, to help himself getting a team, pretty much. So that's your two ballers. And and they have not done anything for Jamaica. We can clearly say so. Both of them have not done nothing for Jamaica. That's the one thing we can all come to. So why you think that they would have changed this time around to do something for Jamaica? And this is not me beating none of the players them, but Aldre seems to always want to disrespect Jamaica and every other player that actually came in and did better than both of his players. Anderson came in, Karai Anderson came in, showcased that he's a better talent than even Whisper at this point. Come in, he never complained about the region, did his job um, with a cameo. Lembekisa proved that he's the best right back we have um, as an option. He's a young kid under 21 as, as well. Mikel Antonio comes in, scored two thunderous goals and link up plays. Jamal Lowe, majority of his games, and he comes, he gets goals contribution. You understand me? KC Palmer showed two good signs. Um, Hector showed his skill set um gray the same so i don't understand why you're you're so big on these people that have not done anything like what are you actually basing these things off because it has to be fantasy but i guess fantasy is connected to pillar oh ironic you need to have some fantasy when you're on the pillar all right so the pillar gang is also the fantasy gang. All right. <laughs> um, bless up, bless up, everyone. Um, up, oh, Jero said, this should teach Grim a lesson. In big fixtures, pick all your best players. Not time for experiment. Mental um, players. Okay. What are the communications? Is, what more communication is needed from the squad? Especially when um, it's a backroom situation. Um, Parish Council says, rubbish. Completely crappy. He's talking, you know. Um, don't get sidetracked, bro. No, no. I, I was post, I posted out two um, things. He said two of them scored for Jamaica before. All right, two of them scored for Jamaica before. Well, everybody in the front line, aside from Kaim Dixon, scored multiple, multiple goals for Jamaica before. So I don't know what you're talking about. Everybody scored multiple goals in the front line for Jamaica. If not played better than Liam Bailey for Jamaica. 
Majority of them played better than Liam Bailey for Jamaica. Every one of them, the care of body, I think their career careers are, they played better for Jamaica than Liam Bailey. So we can still admit that. And obviously, Whisper um, doesn't do anything for the Jamaica team. He was picked just like Oak, um, um, Kayim Dixon got picked. If, if not even different. Because I strongly believe to this day, he was picked only to get caps to go, go to England. Not on talent. All right? And not on actual anything that he did. Aldre. All right? And I can say that publicly and feel very confident in that one. Um, because that's exactly what they said to you. All right? Yes. Um, any 11 on the field is what we are open um, to bring... For, open for to bring us through and the players coming off the bench yeah man we have to support everybody man today a match so why this today seriously um no today is not the match um uh, it should be tomorrow the match all right cad um in morocco with england team all right thank you very for that update um float management big of yourself um parish council said whisper training with chelsea first team um bro um boy jd um I, I like your optimism no i'm just saying give other people credit because i've just rolled out all sorts of facts all right we need to stop the individual separation and encourage um team cohesion but live radio that's exactly what i've just done i've given him only facts why he's supporting a specific set of players and not the entire team and i've named out what his players did and i'm wondering why this is still even a thing um, Conroy said, big up yourself, JD. Thanks for being here. Boza does the same. Um, save and Boza, but Boza wouldn't be considered because he's not in the team because of suspension. Um, Pim said, JD, the man said, um, in Corbrook, we trust. Oh, we end up here. No, Pimp. You, I know Al J. Al J is all over the internet telling me, oh, Jamaica gonna lose and we're gonna get battered. So it's not just in this video. Um, he's doing it. It's everywhere on the internet. Um, pimp. He's fighting. All right, and bigging up his players. Them. Yes. Me see. Um. Um. See video with a baller in a party. A smoke. Um. A data one. Okay. Well, I I have nothing to say about that. Al J will say that it was edited. It was edited by Photoshop. You know. <laughs> Why every time I come on this show, J D. I win. I win with so. I, I, okay, my God. It's Al J. It's Al J. Be fighting with me. I'm here to talk about Jamaica, because it's Jamaica. I'm here to support. But you have the pillow sensational gangs. Um. <laughs> Every stream they are on, they are, they just want Jamaica to lose so they can they can hype up their ballers over the top, you know. Yes, but I can tell you, all of your ballers will feel you because the level that you put them on, none of them are close to that level. All right, yes. Um, uh, Owen, Owen, big up yourself, Chris Smith, big up yourself. Thanks for being here. Fatherling says every day is a Bailey day. Yes, <laughs> Sean Sutherland, big up yourself, man. I'm fire gun and Aunt JD. Honestly, how the conversation reached to this. I just told you guys how the conversation reached here. You get me? Because the guys them want fire gonna off of them want Jamaica to lose. They don't want us to look good because they're two players. Um, Marvin, 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 the only way you think that I'm eating and butler players is if you can't comprehend. Because if you listen to everything that I've said, it cannot be eating. I'm just bringing reality to one of the pillow gangs that was confused by maybe the same man that's telling you a lie and the rest of the Jamaica team um, are not necessarily the truth. So I just brought the truth to them, which you can't, you can't actually refute that. JD, slow down on the whisper. He's a young kid. Well, I'm just bringing, no, he's disrespecting other kids. All right. Um, Omar said, I <laughs> Yes, cause the players that on the squad has played well for Jamaica. That's all I've said. You guys can't take it away from me. It's a fact. All of the guys on the list played well for Jamaica. So to, for you to come here and think that they're not going to do anything, that's, that's a farce. All right? That's all I'm going to say. Even if I don't believe that they're going to win, I'm going to give them a chance to go out there and try something. And I do try and support them because we're all Jamaicans. But to tell me that they can't win because two ballers that have not done anything for Jamaica, and that is just the facts, regardless of who want to hate it or not, it is the facts. They have not done nothing for Jamaica at all. All right? Yes, and the other guys them do have done something for Jamaica. So come on, man. Support the youths, them, man. All right? Um, JD, 
I love how you call out um the Jamalo situation. Yeah, man, yeah, man, of course, of course. Um, Jevon says, sign, JD, I think JFF give up on this match and chose to win the third play, place playoff. So hold on there, hold on there, hold on, hold on there. Yeah, yeah, Panama playing Mexico, which is two teams that we don't beat often. None of them. Um, the fee the favorites going into that game would have been the Mexican team. The last time we bought Man Panama, they scored three on us both times. The first time we could say that we were in transition because of the problems, and we had three nil. And the second half we looked better. Um, Ethan Pinnock tried his best and stuff. You know, a lot of things. Um, and the second second leg we tried even better. So maybe we are a better team and Panama just met us at a point when we weren't good enough. You know? All right. Yes. Determined. The facts is just the facts. Yeah, man. He's determined to tell me something different. If Jamaica doesn't qualify for the next World Cup, we won't see them in our lifetime. Big of yourself, Drew Ross. How you doing, man? Hope all is well. Um, Thomas said, I still believe that we can win. I am not 100% sure that we are going to win the game. I'm not going to tell anybody that lie. All right? But... But what I would do is still support the team because even on um, tactical stream, um, tactical video, I said, I don't believe we are going to win. But this is the way we can come up with something and try. And that was when we had, I, I, I had still believed that two of the players that was on the list coming and two of the players on off the list by now. So that means um, it's kind of dwindling, but I'm still not going to disassociate myself from the team because that would mean I'm only here because of the team having a pot potential of winning. I am going to still watch the game, see who plays well and see who we can continue with in the next one. And then the main competition coming up which is the world cup um qualifiers guys remember we have a video with mr speed coming out later um live stream you guys can get the questions together and let me chop it up and talk some real genuine football um any of them starting um a 50 pound baller no but our uh, only leon bailey is a 35 million pound baller all right yes that's about it. Every one of the other man them value more aside from Kaim Dixon than Whisper. So Alge just come on, man. The more you do that, the more mega call you out with um, the actual facts, all right? Yes, just respect. Alje, come on, man. Rabian, big up yourself. Um, yeah, man, come on, man. Like, like the other youth, man. Come on, man. The man, they might watch them stuff here now. And as he said, Jamaican people don't believe in them. You understand me? Yes, come on, man. I believe we can still um, win. Um, it's, it's going to be tough. Yes, thanks for the honesty. Kwan, said, Jamaica not winning any of the games in this window. Um, we are not favourites for none of the games I'm in the window. That's what, what I do know. We are not favourites against the United States, we are not against Mexico, and we are not against Panama. So, even when we are coming in this window, we weren't the favourites in none of the games them. So, if we don't win the games them, what should change? Yeah, Alright, let me call you out on that one. If we are not favourites for none of the games them, and we don't turn out to win none of the games them, and we look good, would you guys not be satisfied? Because I would be satisfied, you know why we have a depleted squad, we weren't favourites on none of the games, and even with our strongest squad, and we don't turn out to win the games, but we have improved on maybe finding a Karai Anderson, KC Palmer looks better, we might find an extra winger, like Cephas coming into his own, looking better. I am okay with that and maybe Deshaun Bernard can impress us a little bit and Dexter Lembekisa. So all of the areas that we do have problems, if I can see some improvements in those areas, I am pretty up, I'm pretty much happy with that. If I don't, we don't win it, we never, did, we never expected to win anything. You understand me? So we can't spin the narrative to say that, oh, we don't, we lose. We, uh, like Alge, we, we are not favourites for none of the games. Then. Nobody, none of the four teams, we are not better than. And in stats, in not at all. All right? Yes. So then why is it we are beat up the team so we're not going to win? When we weren't any favorites. The only game we have win won under this actual coach that we, we never, we, we never, we weren't favorites was the second game for Canada. Every other game, we either draw or lost it. Once it's an opponent that we, we were below in rankings and also maybe head to head all right 
Um, everybody ready to bash Antonio? No, no, without evidence. No, 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 no. Uh, we, we, we have mentioned that, and that's why our show is becoming so much of a riveting show. You get me? Um, Kadamir Terry out, yes. Um, Rabian says, stop fighting the youths, them. Um, Rabian, I don't know if it's me or your friend Alger you're calling out. Because it could mean I'm me a fight the youths, them, when I'm me a talk good about the youths, them. But the calling out is two omissions that he believed that should have been in this squad and it would have drastically made them good. Which none of them played good for Jamaica. So what, what evidence we have, Rabian, that they would have come this time and played better? And if you can answer that, I would concede. But if you can't, I, I will continue. All right. Um, I think this squad going to play well. I actually think so as well. But well doesn't necessarily translate into winning the game. And well, I would be happy with as well. You get me? I would have been happy if they play, play well and, and show that Jamaica has some future with the better players them coming in. You understand me? That's what I am out here to fight. That cause. Um, we want Jamaica win JD. Laugh or not. But the upcoming match is very difficult. It's a 99% chance we losing. If we had Bailey, it would have been, it would have come. Okay, okay. So that's what you're saying then. It's a 99% chance we are going to lose the game. All right. Okay. If we had Leon Bailey, um, it would have improved our chances to get something from the game. Okay. If you put it like that, then I could say yes. To be honest, we should be challenging for the cup. But it is what it is. No, Rabian, Rabian, you must not, you must have not been watching any Kankaka football to think that we should be challenging for the cup. Off the buck, alright? Them can't win the team not even at 50%. Um, team aggressive. Where I would start is um, Antonio. He was coming off an injury, which was a big injury, and they were trying to ramp up his minutes. But he had gotten an injury in the actual game against Aston Villa. You saw him down on the ground for around four or five minutes. Then he got up, or held his shoulder um, for the longest while. But because he saw out the half time, tried to bring him back on the pitch, and he came off in the 65th, 66th minute. All right, and I came here and said, let me see if that is a big injury because him coming off in the 66 minutes and he was the dominant person on the field. Why would they take him off when they could have given him even 75 to see if he would have gotten a, an extra goal? So I do believe that he had suffered the injury in the Aston Villa game. <coughs> and it's the same one that we're seeing. The same one that we're seeing because that's the good thing why... <coughs> It's a good thing that we stay on business and do our job here. So what we do, we kind of remove the, 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 the ear of speculation. Because most of these people, they speculated, they never watch the players them. They don't watch the players. I'm telling you, they don't watch the players them. They only get the information and they run out and talk on them. They don't watch the games them. So that's why it's good for we to be watching the games so we can update you so when things happen, it, it can take... Take you away from beating the players them unnecessarily. You, so you see the reason for our show. Um, good morning. Will Mr. Speed be on today? Yes, yes. Oh, yes, Mr. Um, later he, he will be on. He should have came on last night. He should have came on last night. But because I had the kid to put to bed, um, we couldn't get, get it done. Um, people, JD said we lose in 2-0. Two, two I said I could see a 2-0 and I explained the other sides where I think something could have gone our way. But I have to be honest. The person said, give me an honest answer. And I gave my honest answer. I don't think we are going to win the game. But oh, we could have set up to win the game. I've given that side as well. That's not me not believing in the team. That's just me looking at the metrics and saying this, what, this is what the metrics gives us. But this is the best chance for we to get an outcome. All right. Up JD. That's why we must have our best 23 and stop using schoolboys. Oh my god. A lot of people is like um um I like Alge in the chat in a man. A lot of people is like Alge in the chat. Um brother, we watch a um, match. I lose for years, decades. We should demand this cup. Rabian, in football. No, we Jamaica have not done anything in football. Um, um, Jamaica have not done anything in football for we to be demanding cups. I'm very sorry. All right. Yes, I think you are putting too much pressure on the guys. Them, let them go out there and fight hard. Yes. Um, determined said, well, JD and Omar.
talk about this whisper sign for Chelsea out of high school. Um, that's a biggie. Okay, um... I don't even think your statement there is accurate, but I will just le let you stay in your fantasy um, realm, all right? I'm not going to educate you on nothing, because if I educate you, you're going to say we are bad-minded. So let me leave it alone. Just do what you want to do, all right? Just do what you want to do and say what you want to do. I'm, I say what you want to say. I'm not going to argue with you. Anything you know and you think that's a fact, you stay with it. I'm not going to provide you with the facts. That simply means you didn't take your time to... F to, to to research it, you, t you just jump to what you want for to make it. You're right there, you have the pillar gang as well. You know. I told you that, so I'll let, leave you alone. Danica said, JD, you want Pastor? But I told him that you don't want him on the interview. I told him, I said, you are not going to stop him from coming on the interview. All right, so I guess what we're going to do, we're, I'm going to have a set of things that I'm going to ask Mr. Speed for the first 30 minutes or so, and then I will let on the other guys them. All right, yes, but I'm not going to start Pastor because Pastor is going to mash up my interview from the start. All right, yes. And it's Pastor is going to make it about himself when really and truly is for the people to get the information. I hope he can just eat, listen to me good and just be better equipped for other people i have not seen him being that person ever in life so i hope he can attain it today and i love that i'm using the words for the word smith so corey done good for jamaica as a striker sign i'm not against leon suspension but missing so much players differently give us no chance all right so everybody want I, I just want the man them go out there and just play something miraculous you know this is why the coach need to give roof and andre gray a looking and stop relying on solely on antonio shadow strike i would agree with that barely in top form right now people we have to be honest and we we had given him we had said that don't we should go for the cup regardless of players yeah but the other countries are bigger footballing nations they are bigger programs they are spending more money and to be frank they are better players so what give us the rights to say we have to be going for the cup or else if we don't get the cup we should fire the coach and uh, what give us the right because you have to have that right you have to have some some proof to say we have that right all right yes <laughs> it's a two hours race we have a chance to win all right if goal um a house Corey burke sleep outside um leroy said speed um said um, a player cannot be replaced in the squad if he withdraws for any um for any injury so i would guess romario came in uh, as came in for antonio um, I think, I think, um, well, let, let me wait, let me wait before, because the, the, what the, what the facts stated for, um, serious reasons and a man turning down Jamaica and not turning up for Jamaica is also a serious reason because that means he would have given you the rights to say that he's turning up and then didn't. All right. Um, easier path um, to the world cup in years. Uh, you, you know, this, this story of easier path. Let me, let me break down things. And this is why I've said, you know. Um, this is why we have said. This is why we have uh, we have said. Um, Jamaica is not serious um, about leaving, leaving on Bailey. I am all for discipline. Okay, so you're saying Jamaica is not serious for leaving out Bailey. Oh my God. Grimmy isn't serious about winning. Joke thing for real. Leaving out Bailey. Forgive the man and move on. All right, all right. Damn. Antonio broke on the commitment curfew. No, Sing. No, no. Good Lord. Sing. Oh, my God. You, you, don't, you only was watching only Mika, Leon Bailey on the field. Good Lord, man. Uh, will co co Coach bring Leon back? I don't think so. You can't You can't do that so publicly and then bring him back. And to be honest, oh, Leon Bailey I got to bring back now. Leon Bailey can play a game tomorrow. If Leon Bailey play a game tomorrow, he tumbles down on his head top people he can't play a game tomorrow all right and i'm not going to explain to you why he can't play a game tomorrow if it's your player you would have known that he can't play a game tomorrow all right yes so just the, in the research your player and see what your player doing all right <laughs> omar that's a fact you can't erase history no determine it's not a fact you have omitted a lot of things out of it and you're showing yourself determine it is not a fact all right it is not actually a fact. 
It's what you have heard and what you want to believe because you want to make it seem like somebody have done things over the top, which is not the truth. All right? Yes, which is not the truth. And we're, I'm not going to argue that with you either too. Um, in my opinion, I don't think Leon Bailey would have improved the team. Yes, but that's what I'm saying. Um, I don't think they're saying if we, if we want to bring Leon Bailey in, no. But none of them have watched what the guy is doing over the last two days. You understand me? So, oh, if you don't know what he was doing over the last two days, and we know what he was doing over the last two days. Oh, you see, that's what I'm telling you. You guys are just making up stories, you know. You understand me? I'm not really watching. But you know what? We are not. They said I'm an informer yesterday when I told them what he was doing. Um, JD, you once said don't underestimate the underdog teams. And Jamaica is going. Um, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Ryan Graham, give them a chance to prove himself. Um, Alj said, JD, um, Bailey is on vacation and will be watching the game and supporting players. I would love to see him in the stands. Because I saw other guys when they were on vacation watch the game in the stands as well. Don't be in your house watching it from a TV. Be in the stands to make sure you and, and sign some autograph for some of your your fans them and post it and say that you're gonna be in this, the stands so you can bring more people to the game to support the players them. Not in your house and be going to other parties. All right? Yes. Because you see all you guys look at things. Um, him in his house, um, watching the game. What that does for Jamaica team? Nothing. But when, when the other persons was not picked, what they did, and they were in Jamaica, they came to the games, come and support the, the players them from the, the stands and told people that they, were, they, they never got picked. You understand me? Yes. See if I was going to turn up. Hope Grimmie don't go start, t um, start 10. Uh, Romario said, foolishness, JD. All right, good Lord. So me say, me say, Romario, the man forgot a game. And stand up and sign autograph for people and try to get more people in their stands. And you said that is a foolishness. Wow, Romario. God, God need to help you. God need to help you. All right? Yes. <laughs> score prediction? I've given my score prediction, you know, but um, I think it changes every single time, you know? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to wait until tomorrow when we know exactly everybody in camp. Because it looks like people turning up and turning out. Um, J Jamaica love the whole underdog foolishness. And life no work like that most of the times, I know. But um, obviously, <laughs> um, being an underdog is something special because it get, it, it rump, up your, um, rump up your adrenaline to a different degree. And we have always talked about that. So maybe that's what we needed because that's what Mr. Algrimson thrive under. All right? JD, Mr. Bailey, uh, suck jelly, wicked. Uh, guys, you know that something is wrong. Something is wrong with um, Andrew 55. I think something is very much wrong with um, Andrew 55. You know, I, I honestly believe something is wrong with the man. You know, yes. God, God help Andrew 55. <laughs> uh, Mr. Dre. <laughs> it's just Andrew 55. Something is wrong with him and sucking. You understand me? Every day he comes here, he finds a different way how to implement his terminologies. All right? And it's not working. <laughs> Romario. Romario. <laughs> Sorry, Romario. Um, I never meant it. I, I, I just started to read the comment like how I was reading all of the comments. <laughs> but uh, you know what now? You see after today, um, you see after today, I am I'm going to scrutinize every one of his comments and I'm going to start passing his, his comments because he offers nothing um, to the actual conversation. He's just a comedy type of person. All right, people? Yes, I'm very sorry. Very disrespectful, you know. <laughs> um, five minutes before the game is prediction time, JD. Can't look so far ahead with all with, with, with this team at all. Yes, I think. Uh, uh, and someone said, is Maggie starting? The last time I checked, uh, Maggie never started. So let me see. Um, the last time I checked, um, I, w I was watching something. And I swore I saw... 
that Maggie might have scored a 20 yarder or it was just um, a propaganda um, statement of Maggie because when I'm looking here, uh, Maggie have not scored. He started on the bench as to where I saw him the last time. But you see, I'm telling you. So, boy, misinformation is all over the place because I swore I thought he would have scored, you know. I thought he came on and scored, you know, but he never came off the bench. So, Maggie have not um, played as yet in the USL. So, Maggie is not much fit as yet, you know. Yeah. Which you can't take a man that is not much fit to play tomorrow. You understand me? Yes. JD, what do you think um the coach um pre-match interview will be like? Um every it's a tough game. They were better than us from day one. Um so it's not a biggie. Uh, we are just gonna go out there and fight hard. Well, that would would be my statement, you know. We have everything going against us, so it's the best time for we to start making something, making some history, you know? Not just beat them on, on this day, but beat them with a weakened squad. <gasps> just like how they came out with a weakened squad and we had our full squad, and they got a draw out of the game. And to be honest, by my estimation, they should have won the game because they were the, over, the overall better playing team on the 90. Um, and I'm not going to take that. I'm not going to take away. That is just the truth. So that tells me that Jamaica can go out there and have a strategy. And um, obviously, it's not going to look like theirs. But we can have a strategy that cause as much problems as possible. All right. Yes. So, guys, let me take a little time out and hit the like button, share, and subscribe. Very much important to the content. How oh, to find the like? Um, please click the triple dot below your right at the lower end of your, your screen, and it's going to pop up the like button and then you can click the like there it's a little bit different from the normal format but because sometimes i i don't have everything um pr prepare i have to just go through this way so take your time out hit the triple dot and then you can hit the likes up and get it to 80 90 because we have like what 170 people here so the like should not be 50 likes you know it should be way more up to 100 um, and it tells me if youtube not showing the likes it's going to be very hard for people to like the damn video you understand me? Because on our normal video would have been on 200 likes, 150 likes, or 130 likes by now. All right. So get the likes up. And people, thanks. Um, I saw a few people eating it. But let me get it over closer to the 70, 80 mark. You know, that is more respectful. And then we can talk about it at the end of the um the end of the stream. stream. Grimmy went into interview talking about he will beat USA um, team. It must shame you know. Um, the thing is, he is no unpredictable. You can bet it's the same formation. I, I think it's going to be the same formation. But who will be playing the, the, the system? I think it's going to change because Mikel Antonio comes with something different. You know? Honestly, without the likes of Gray and, or the other uh, RA player like Maggie, we are not looking good. But original pre, you have um, Casey Palmer there. Casey Palmer is like a billion times better than Maggie. That is not even a question. That is just a full out, flat out, flat out statement. Casey Palmer is miles better than Maggie. You know? And he does everything that Maggie does. I'm telling you. We just dev never watch the games. Um, you know? But he does everything that Maggie does. Every damn thing. Everything that Maggie can do at 100%, it's like 70% for him. I'm telling you that. You get me? Yes. But I, 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 I guess I would have to bring the proof to you um, next week. Next week I haven't come as yet, you know. And I'm going to bring the proof to you next week. Just watch. <laughs> Tomorrow is a prime day for a star to be born. No, original pre. Don't take my word for it. Just go and check the internet. Casey Palmer is miles better than Maggie. Without injury, Casey Palmer would have been maybe like a, like a, my boy, my, um, um, that we want to put um, um, Gibbs White. Casey Palmer would have been the Gibbs White that Gibbs White became. Without injury. And maybe behavior issue. But we will take out the behavior issue. And just say injury. Injury. Mag Maggie should stick to seasoning meals. What? <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> wow. Um, all right. All right. All right. So let me. Let me set this right here. All right. So, oh, we would set up a team now like oh, we don't have a Mikel Antonio. Do we have these bustling forwards? These bustling forwards to take occupy two defenders? Um, Corey Burke. Does Corey Burke still have the speed, the, uh, um, the overall 
athleticism to occupy two defenders at that I ilk. If did he actually had that um, um, ability to occupy two centre backs at the same time um, at a high level? I have not seen him done it ever in his career because his career span between MLS and the JPL. You understand me? So the, these players that they're using now is more higher level players of worldwide ilk. So it's going to be a challenge, but I want to say that anybody, anybody that would have the capability of doing it on this list, I would say it would be Corey Burke, Corey Burke of the makeup, the strength, um, to, to play a Shamar Nicholson or a Mikel Antonio style role. He's the only one on this list that actually has that ability. That a young kid would have had the ability as well, which is Bailey Kadamateri. But he's not on this list now. And people saying that he's already in Morocco um, with England. So we only have that striker. So would he go with that and then use a Romario Williams behind that to add that little depth? And that's the difference now. Mikel Antonio gives, that, gives you that by himself. So you could have a KC Palmer, a, a DJ behind him just to create, you know? But you would need two persons to do what Mikel Antonio does on a high level. All right. Um, Big of of Orlando says, Reggae Boys are live. Original preset, JD, add some sort of annotation to your stream. You're analytical, you're analytical enough to pull it off. Oh, God. <laughs> um, remember, 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 remember. Um, hold on, hold on. Let me see what I want because... All right, no filter. Okay. Yeah. They, might, they have some... They have some they have some, they have some, some little thing here, you know, me, me go, I'm a pop star, so let me add some pops, oh, dance party, ooh, ha ha, and we can have dance party in the building, so why you guys never told me that I can have dance party here, <laughs> um, it, true, uh, me no say, um, when Jamaica win, um, me I run up and down. Um, I was like a madman. All right. Yes. So guys, we have a we have a lot of features here. Damn. I never knew that. I never knew that. I can even turn into a sketch artist. Woo! Wow. Silver screen. Yeah. Yeah. This. this. All right. Let me let me pull up the documentary. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Document. Yeah. Eight millimeter. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> All right. The dream. All right. Yes. Yes. The dream is the right one because the pillow gangs are here. So you need to produce something for them that they are used to. So Aljay and all of those guys, this is the filter for you guys. All right. Let me click it right here. I know I have my, my dream background. JD, please don't mention Kadamateri. He's not here. Talk about Dixon and Romario. But I've talked about them. Um, 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 Romario. All right. Um, big of yourself, Mr. Revolution. Kevin Williams said they should stop pick medic mediocre uh, players because when the first team players pulls out, there is no depth. All right. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> um, it's time to move on from some of some of our older players. Try get Mother Seal and Barstow um, and in the team. Well, um, they said they wanted to play. No cap, though. JD, um, you are related to. IT? Who is who is IT? IT. I wonder if you're talking about the comedians. IT and fancy cat. Um, I don't look like them though, so I don't think that is true. You know, we need a new striker. Well, Kadamatier was the one that we are banking our hopes on. Uh, we are Malik Madasil doing very um IT I um Ellis. Man, IT Ellis, I don't know who is that. My last name is Daly, so I don't know. I don't think so. Um, Kirk, um, English. Big up yourself, thanks for being here. Massive, massive respect. Guys, we need 30 more likes to get the likes up um, to that level. All right, so let me look at it. I, I'm, I'm thinking now, I'm way more convinced that it's going to be a 4 4 one, one now, or a 4 5 one. I'm way more convinced. I don't think we're going to use two strikers. We're going to use more of a, um, a five in midfield to try and stop them because you don't of that bustling forward to take away the pressure and unlock others so i think we're going to try and stuff the midfield to 
to try and see if we can win uh, win back anything to counter them um, because speed transitions will be our only way out through the wide channels um, to be honest 352 Blake Hector Low Bernard Dexter Lay um, DJ Palmer Barbary Jamalo and Burke all right, all right. Three, five, two. Now look bad. Even though I just said I think that they're gonna go lippy diva. Me nervous now. Uh, Manavala, Romario said it from from IT and Fantacat. Okay, okay, okay. Um, big up yourself, DJ Governor, and we have the greatest in the building, Jason Fedan from um, wherever he's from. You know, yes, maybe Jamaica, maybe United States. You know, yeah, one of those two. All right. Um, yeah, man. People press the like button, trip the click the triple dot. No, I'm a no, I'm a I'm a, I'm a ghost in in the in the um the the pillar gangs army. And I have the feature to pull it off. Oh my God. They're going to... <laughs> I'll humbly await your prediction tomorrow, JD. Oh my God. Uh, what about... What's up with the filter around the screen? It's because the Pillow Gang is so much out and running. I've gotten a dream filter. A dream filter. You know, specially made for the Pillow Masses. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh 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 no let me change about this filter because mana said it, the filter looks like rainbow um i don't all right so we can highlight save your all right so this is the dance party all right so this is the dance party so stop about this rainbow foolishness all right real talk let's um get the likes going yeah, man, massive respect. I'm um, glad to find that Jamaicans trust in the process. Yeah, man, but we always trust the process, you know. The difference with us, we will not tell you that we're going to be winning when we ain't going to win nothing. All right? If the mathematics says we're not going to win it, I'm going to tell you that I am going to be looking for different things, like players improving and such. All right? Um, boss, I represent um, for the Pisces. Oh, my. Um, Governor, um, no, DJ Geek says, um, why some people keep saying that overseas players are not committed? Um, why when Leon um, break? No, um, um, DJ um, Geeks, that will always be a thing. It will not change. So we just move past them. Let them just keep themselves because they are looking attention and notoriety. You understand me? And they are sad souls. So let we leave the sad souls in the dreamland. Just that, uh, in the dreamland. Let them stay with the dreamland. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, and then we have a government said, JD, you know, um, to be honest, I would love um, to win this game just to shut up some of the chat him out um, so-called fans them but th that's what that's weird no i want to win the game regardless you know but I, I i do agree with you you know why because if you we win this game it will have shown that we don't need certain distractions around the team and they can go about their business uh you know yes all right uh why do you think uh, who do you think will win the fa cup Edit man's edit man. Uh, edit man. Um, I think it's going to be Manchester City. All right. Yes. JD, the world will be watching later when Mr. Speed comes on. Yes, he's going to come on. He wanted to come from yesterday. And Mr. Speed is an honest man. So I will have the conversation with him. All right. Um, Bailey never show up for Jamrock. So those people who say the coach shouldn't suspend him, tell him, tell me without cap. Uh, okay, that is Claudine complaining. All right. Um, Kevin Facey, good afternoon, um, JD. Um, I am very nervous now, um, but I believe if everyone does their job, we still can get something from this game. But you have to include that the other guys them don't do their job from my, um, um, USA because I think if everyone from USA does their job and we do, do our job as well, we have to be honest to ourselves. More likely, we would have come out on the end part of the stick. Because the quality of the players them that they do have, um, they have a much more higher, higher level to reach. All right? Yes. And they have they have more reps under their belts and everything. So I'm not going to lie to anybody. All right? Um, yeah, the disco like to rocking. Let me know if you guys like it, you know? Yeah, the, the swag diggy going on, you know? Yes. Um, determined said, JD, any information coming out um, of the reggae boys? Let me see um, what is the latest one. Because today should be... Oh, yeah, thank you very much. 
No, no, no. It's 50-50. It's not a calling show. And it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, my brother. I, I saw you doing show the whole night, you know? My thing say, you did say what you want to say the whole night, you know? <laughs> yeah, but it looks like you still have something versus still 50-50. 80-20. You know? Yeah. Um, so today should be the press conference. And it's going to start 12.30 Jamaica time. 12.30 Jamaica time. So when we are having the discussion with me and Mr. Speed, that's when the press conference will be held. All right? Yes. So maybe I will go through that and then after I will do this, the, the, the recap to the press conference. Or maybe in, in, the other day I will do so. All right? Yes. So 50-50. Um, no, man. You're good, man. Me, me, me hear everything we have to say already here. Um, when them say, uh, when them say, um, I go on our JD, <laughs> and new Mina said, but la guzu, um, the team, no man, it's just football and things happen, you know, what's your source, um, for news, um, to be honest, my source of news is just keeping, um, tabs with the court, the, the teams, because I've watched all the games, check all the information, um, on the players, them, because we're doing a Jamaica or a, abroad, so it should not be so hard for me to track 50, 60 players, it's not like I'm tracking 7, 10 different teams overall, you know, I'm checking the individuals, them, um, throughout the teams, them, so once you click them, notification, if they have an injury, if they score, everything comes up, so it's very hard in 2024 to track people, um, JD, what, what is Bibi Gardner position, I don't know, you know, I don't know at all, I need to listen a little bit more, I, I've completely, um, completely forgot that, all right, so later, the, the, um, the post, press conference will be there, yeah, um, JD, source will come on the show later today. JD, JD, source will come on the show. No, that is a lie, Romario. How can Mr. Spade be my source when I know things but before Mr. Spade them know the things them? Majority of the times. Because they are busy coaching their teams and I am watching football. The, the fact that I'm, I'm, I'm around same way talking only football, that tells you um, what I'm doing was transcendent um at the time for the category and you should give me more respect um just telling you the score jd all right so let me see um let me see where where the score is i i have passed the score okay jamaica um jamaica jamaica okay jd usa seven jamaica nil oh my god uh, okay I, i've missed the score I had missed it for the right reason. <laughs> um, Bibi, a support um, for the team when them lose. Well, well, tell you what. That means Bibi is a real patriot. Patriot of the country, you know? Yes. He, he, he has enough money. Um, he has enough clout to be partying when the team playing. But he decided that he's going to take his talents to um, contribute to his country. So, Aldre, um, you don't see that as um, very good? You, you see that as in my turn up because they're going to lose. Oh my, Aldre. Aldre, you can't be passing 25. Aldre, after call you out, you can't be passing 25. You know, you, you can't be passing 25. When a, when a man should be lauded for what he's doing, you're bringing him down. And when a man should be disrespected for what he's doing, you seems to uplift him. Wow. It does not matter how many players... Um, US have the game are never a blowout. S Technic. Um we had several games with the United States that that were blowouts. So stop the, the foolishness, S Technic. Let me give the people the actual results. Um with USA and Jamaica. USA um vs Jamaica head to head results. It's, it, it has gotten closer, but that doesn't mean it never started from a blow. So let me not start the um, big boss because I don't want people to say that I'm misleading people. All right. So I'm going to give you all the head to heads um, for Jamaica and um, United States. All right. Yes. Let me get it right here. I'm trying to get the whole of them. Uh, let me go back. Uh, let me go and get all the results them for Jamaica. Um, so we, we can go from in the 60s and give you all of them. Transfer market. Transfer market will, uh, will have all of them. Transfer market. So I can give it to you. 
Yes, yeah, so um, detail squad, Jamaica. All right, so Jamaica, yeah. Um, people JD is very <laughs> very charismatic um, with his answer. I swear, laugh out loud, bro. You need to be a liar. Oh my god. This is this man is taking a piss with me, man. He's taking a piss at this point. Where is Jamaica Games? Let me get all the games. Um, one second, people. I'm gonna pull up all the games so we can give you when we had, we had to play the United States. Yes, because maybe some people tell tell Estekni that Estekni is just, just a run with it and I am not going to be um, a storyteller here. I'm going to give Estekni the facts. and Because uh, I know the facts don't rank up like old Estekni telling me. All right? I, I don't need the players. I need, I need results. I need results. All right? All right. So let me go up to USA and see. 5-0 um, is the biggest... Um, the biggest and people are uh, kill me for a, a few a four nil prediction. I thought we lost even a friendly four one just the other day when we are getting in the players them, but we can't count that because we are getting in the players them, and uh, they weren't. A re you know they weren't. Uh, all right, all fixtures. Okay, so I can get all fixtures between um, both teams. That is good. Let me read them out. You know, um, for you. All right, all fixtures. All right, where is all the fixtures? Okay, we want all the fixtures for Jamaica and um, for all time, all time. So why they don't show all time? Jesus, God, you know. All right, um, but all I know is that it, it is not, it is not um, always close. It's not always close. They had, they had periods where they, they were clearly dominant over us. Um, uh, regarding... Um, the age you mentioned list just just now when I, when i listened some of them talk i get the understanding that they are very young in age and a mentality um i believe that our coach uh, will put um something big in the match what's with the strobe light are we are or or you in belgium red light district no, I'm in my, my bedroom. But well, my bedroom of a studio different. Yeah, so, you know, giving a vibes, you know, and uh, billing, breaking down the morning crack. Yeah, so thanks everyone that came in and supported. Donovan, big up yourself. Massive respect. Oh, yes, guys, you know, I should tell you this. Um, we are going at a rapid rate, people. A rapid rate. Um, as in the subscription, we said that we wanted um, 10,000. And we were at 120 subscribers a day ago. A day ago, you know, and you know that we are literally 40 subscribers away from 10,000. So that means over two days, we have garnered, we have garnered our own 70, 80 subscribers. And it looks like today might be the day that we get the entire 100. So 100, and, uh, we're aiming for 100 and add something um, subscribers in two days. So let me eat it, people. So if you have not subscribed, be the time to get us to the 10,000. Let me aim back for 20,100. Then we start dominate back the Jamaican streets. Dominate. Yeah. <laughs> um, back in Canada, uh, big of yourself, Warren. Aliens coming for JD. <laughs> <laughs> JD, my thing is this, no player is bigger than um, um, the football because I've never seen um, football chasing any player. It's, it's players that chase football. Yeah, facts. Um, Real Baller said, so good, um, had to start um, all over. And that's good. <laughs> yeah, so 10K. Yeah, man, 10K is possible today because you guys are subscribing at a rapid rate. So I guess... Oh, I guess I am putting down some quality, um, quality performances for you guys still to be finding this as one of the most entertaining channels you can find around. All right. Yes, man. I, I love it. I love it. Uh, what, where, where is it? I am trying to update. Uh, see. Uh, oh, okay. So people even still subscribing. Thanks very much. Oh, JD, I'm speaking of recent time. Yes. Recent times, the games have been, um, Closer, that is definitely true. And that's what I was saying. In recent times, the games have been closer. Yes. But um, what we have not faced them, to be honest. We have not faced their big team over the last uh, one and a half year. 
because we face them. Um, no, 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 no. Let me stop this foolishness. You see the game. Let me type in this one. Let me type in this one. United States. Jamaica versus United States. Jamaica versus United States in United States. When Ricardo Pepe scored two goals, that game was not no close game at all. That was a domination and should have been seriously a lot of goals. All right? That was a dominative um, performance from United States. Believe me, man. And the only thing we could have talked about is Maggie making 15 passes or 20 passes. But that was a dominant um, performance from United States. Let me get up here. 2-0. Um, that was the, the 8th of um, October 2021. That was a dominant one. Let me give you the stats right here. 17 shots to 5. 62% ball possession. 7 shots and 3 shots block. With um, 7 off target right there. And let me continue to go down um, on um, the fixtures right here. Um, five big chances. They have missed three out of the five um, in that game. I can celebrate people. Um, um, in the first 15 seconds or 25 seconds, Taxi should have rightfully be sent off in the game. That is just facts. Um, obviously, they, um, maybe it was too early and they never wanted the game to go into a landslide. You go back and watch that game, guys. That was a dominant display. Um, S technique. Yes, but they, I think they have faced our big team in the Gold Cup with their weaker team. The, JD, the, games, the game in Jamaica that was um, stolen. And, and even that game, yes, I think the goal from Glow was a legitimate goal. But let me bring in that, that same game, Javier Brown should have been sent off in that same game. So it's a good thing that we never had VAR in that same game. All right? Yes. So we should remember those things as well. All right. So both things, even though I thought that we played massively better in that game, massive, it was a massive upgrade, a massive upgrade. Because we held them to only nine shots, nine shots in the game, and we had six shots in the game. All right. We held them to nine shots. And it's very few times we could say that we play United States and held them to nine shots. And they had no big chances in the game. And we had a big chance in the actual game. So it was a definitely better performance from Jamaica right there. Yes, but I had to just bring the information in so you could know. Yes, and the, the position was the same, 62 to 38. Um, Taxi was um, last man on that play. Um, he was no, but everyone, even the commentator, said it was a red card. But for some reason, he never got the red card in that one. But I'm just telling people to go back and watch the game, so they don't believe that I'm just making up things. They can go back, and then it shows how how I retain information. Our retain information on, on all games. Um, JD, this match will show if the team is disciplined because it will be a tough match for us. Big up yourself, Travis. Uh, massive respect. All right. So you see, you see no, um, you see it, um, what, what's his name again? S technique. Yes, so I can reason out things and reason from a, a, a balanced standpoint because I've retained the information, and that's why sometimes when I don't come up and overhype certain things. People don't understand that because I'm basing everything from a logical perspective. You know, because I retain the information. All right? Um, JD, why are you so, so close to the camera? Um, brother, why should I be far from my camera and be on my wall? All right? <laughs> Morning, JD. Well, as they say, you go to war with the, uh, with the army. You have not necessarily the one you the the one you want or what you want. All right, fair enough, fair enough. Can't say anything otherwise. We might not win, but I want a good effort. The the, the comment of the day, the comment of the day. Even though we have to burn out Real Bala because he's a biased Ross, you know. But that's what I want. If we not win. Guys, if you're listening, if you don't win, just put out a good performance because the game, the, 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 the project doesn't stop here. Don't listen to the naysayers, all right? Because the same naysayers will pull up the facts and say you never would have, you weren't the favorite from day one. So why are you killing me if I don't win? You understand me? Yes. Um, I guess I guess JD really did it um, the wall. Laugh out loud. <laughs> Yeah, there, yo, what? The feature's bad, damn. So why they don't have like a green screen thingy uh, for me? 
Um, so we all agree we ain't winning this match. No, no, I'm just saying um, if we don't even win the match, we can have, okay, they said I can have some bubbles on the screen. Okay, the bubbles thing now going to work in a Jamaica space, you know. They said this is glamour. All right, the glamour thing not going <laughs> to. All right, so this is glow. All right, the glow thing might work in the Jamaica space, you know, because they always be saying that they're they be glowing and all of those madness, you know. Yes, yeah, so people, I'm going to put glow, glow, all right, so the glow working now. So you guys can stop um, complaining about um, I am, I am doing all sorts of madness, all right. Uh, <laughs> all right, thanks for the 100 likes, guys. Let me make it 150. One fifty um, on the board. Tuma big win for tomorrow. Tyrone Williams. All right, yeah man. Oh, do we win this game? Oh, we win this game. Um, I've explained the same thing. I think I I think it wouldn't really change so much. Different from when Mikel Antonio was on the slate. All right, I'm going to go with. We still um stay. Uh, we are going to be um in our mid 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 block. Um. And I'm saying not mid block, you know, pretty much in a low block, you know. But we are going to be on the top of our, at the starting of our midfield third. That's where we're going to be fighting out this game. And then um, we're going to rely on the counters, you know. Korberg very fast. Cephas very fast. Jamalo very fast, you know. Barbary technical. Um, Casey Palmer, good quality passer as well. Top, top shelf for the region. All right. Yes, yeah, so we have good players. So we have to just open hope that um, United States midfield doesn't have a dominant display, which majority of the times when all three of them plays, which have uh, uh, actually been a long time now, they have dominated, to be honest. No bubble bath. Yard man. <laughs> uh, three we are getting. Kerry and Spence. Okay. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Defensive mid with Damian Low, Romario. If that happens, a six we are get. I can fully say that. You understand me? And um, we are get a red card early in the game as well too. Maybe two yellow cards. I don't be the one who knows it. United States is a different type of animal. All right. We don't want to expose our backline. So coach, don't don't be fooled by the little cameo the last time. And say you want to put a man at defensive midfield. So he has space in behind with his rush tackles. How oh, that even makes sense? This man only makes rush tackles. And you're going to put him up the pitch. That, and people will pass him. That is guaranteed. Guaranteed. And he has to make tackles. When he only makes rush tackles. He don't make no other tackle than rush tackles. Period. That is just a fact. So I want him to stay in the defense line and just do him the damn job. So be a better center back. Yes. JD, remember to ask Mr. Speed about Malik Madasil. Um, but you're not going to be here. That means you're telling me that you're not going to turn up. All right? So turn up and then I will ask him. Um, El Padrino said, true talk. Yeah, we, we know the truth, but you know, the pillar massive them. Um, what is your view on Mattox? How things played out for his career. Mattox was a very, very much self-centered individual that believes in his own skill set. I think Mattox is like the Zlatan of the CONCACAF. He, he did his thing. He did his thing in the CONCACAF. Uh, no, I wouldn't say CONCACAF. I would say he's a Zlatan of Jamaica. You know, yes, believes in himself. And he went out there and proved himself. So I, I like, I like Matt, Mattox, you know, I like him. I, he he says things and he goes out there and prove it. He, he never proved it on the level that you would say Leon Bailey and the other guys then. But he every every chance he got, he did his thing. So I'm not gonna beat the youth for believing, um, believing in himself and go out there and prove it. All right, yes. So big ups to Mattox. You know, yes. There's Latin of the um Jamaican space. Yeah. <laughs> Wicked baller for sure. Um, there can only be one Zlatan. Well, I'm telling you, a Zlatan from our region. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, yeah, man. Mattox was a good player, people. Um, he never got the opportunity like Liam Bailey and Shamar Nichols and those guys. But he did what he had to do um, the whole time. So let me put some respect on Big Mattox's name, all right? 
Wicked baller for sure. Yeah, man, a good good player, good player. Um, I, I never saw him at the, the highest level, so I can't put him in the wicked baller stage. And for persons that watch him from different country, wicked actually mean very good. Um, in in more of the English language, all right? Yes. But uh, you know, we have our own languages and that we do speak on, on these platforms, all right? Yes. So for USA fan base, yes, wicked mean not wicked as in he's an evil individual, but um, actually a very good footballer at the level that he was playing. The true quality of Jamalo will show in this game. Even though we have the inferior quality, I think the hunger of these players will put um, it off. Two goals to one. All right. Big up a cell, Lamar Henry. All right. What, what's the deal with Andy Cole, son? It looks like you're not know, you know, let me take over Simon AI. Arms job, you know. I can't take over Simon's AI job. All right. Yes, he has to do his what's the deal. Um, he started that thing. And for me, um, I heard that it was some papers issues issues that have not completed. So I will wait um to see. Can't can't want um to hang the man, bro. <laughs> All right, so let me test how, how people feel. Every club t um, taking precaution during the business end of the season. Um, Fabi Frano. But Fabi Frano, if you watch the game, you would have realized that he had a very tough drop. If it was not for, for Mikel Antonio, majority of the rest of the world would have been injured. But because he's, he's a superior specimen of a human being, um, he bounced up like a sponge, you know. <laughs> um, are you going to the match? No, I won't be attending um, this match. Sadly, the only match I'm going this weekend is actually Suriname versus Martinique in Netherlands. All right, yes. But um, obviously, you know that I'm on the Belgian side, the European side, so um, certain games are easier for me to go. Um, but um, I will give you the full support um, of what I've always given um, for the Jamaica national team. <laughs> All right, so guys, um, since you guys beat me up for so long, we have 178 in the chat. Please give me your take as to what you think. All right, let, let, me, let me take some calls. Let me take some calls, you know, because I saw 50, 80, 90, 20. I, I, four hours, I don't know if 50, 20, 90, 20 is not sleeping. You understand me? Because he's asking me if it's a call-in show. But um, I've just changed my service to... Um, the normal data service so i should be able to get calls so you can call in guys all right the number let me get the number for you and let me pin the number on for your people one second all right let me pin the number for you all right let me pin the number for you All right, one second, guys. Let me pin the number for you so you can call in and give you a take. All right, uh, plus 466 46, 24, 71. Okay, no, 32. 32, 466 Yeah, so that's, that should be the number. And for the persons that said it looks like a scammer number, no, it is the extension for Belgium. Um, you have plus 44 for England, plus 32 for Belgium. So that's just, that's just the simple difference. All right? Yes. <clears throat> so if you want to call in, please call in now so I can wrap the show within two hours and so I can go and get some food and such. All right, but give me a prediction if you're not going to call in. Like everyone here, just drop the prediction, let me know. Malik Madison should be in the team. We're, but, but we don't know if he, he got um, some... Obviously, he was not in the 60s, so that means they weren't looking um, his direction. All right, all right. So original precess two one or one are one nil. Both of them in favor of Jamaica. Okay, so that means um it has to go with the the, the route that we said we're we're gonna try and um achieve that, which is sitting back. 
You know, yes, if we're going to get any one of those results. Um, JD, choose Suriname over Jamaica game. No, I'm going to be doing the Jamaica game. Get no sleep to go back on the road. Um, so that tells you that I kind of prefer the Jamaica game because for Suriname, I'm going there physically. But I don't have to lose any sleep. So you see, that's how you see this thing. Las Blanco says 6-0. Um, Jamaica get in. Six would be a strong statement. Strong, strong statement. Pepsi, big up yourself, thanks for being here. You need to call in and give me a, give me your take on, 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 on the game, you know, all right? I would love that. Jamal Lowe scored on USA already, so I know he can score again. Yes, he can. He can, yeah. Frano says, um, US to win 3-1. Um, our team is too depleted, all right? Um, Pagan, big up yourself. We're not getting a six. Well, well, Pagan, just give you what we are going to get or if we are going to get anything at all and we are, or we are going to be giving out some beatings. Let me know. All right? All right, so El Padrino says 1-1. One, one. It can't be 1-1. One, one. It has to be something, somebody winning. So 1-1 on one, one, penalties. How much penalties we scoring? All right? Because remember, you know, look at that. Um, both of these keepers are exceptional um, keepers. Um, which one of them you think is better shot stoppers? Which one of them you think is better? No, better penalty stoppers. Which one of them you think are better penalty stoppers? Let me know. Um, let me know which one of them are better. Andre Blake. Andre Blake. Um, go ahead, Carla. Go ahead. You're live on the iMaxit platform. You're live on the iMaxit platform. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Hope all is well, sir. How are you doing? How are you? I am not well because I have to be fighting with the head of the pillar gang. Yes. Okay, JD. So, first of all, I'd like to um, just wish the team the best of luck. I know we're, we're looking a little bit slim uh, we're missing a lot of players but this is the perfect opportunity for god to 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 make a name for themselves all right um, for the national team and uh, um yeah all i'm asking for is a good fight uh, if we win great if we don't at least we i just wanted to put it put in the fight um i know you have speed on your show later on today Please, baby, I'm begging you. Uh, don't don't beg me anything. You don't need it. To, you don't need to beg me anything because you're not gonna steer how I do things. Okay. What you can do is, when the time come, all you need to do is just turn up and just say what you have to say, and then we will put it out. I'm probably gonna be at work. Okay, I'm probably gonna be working. So I'm asking if you could you please just ask them some tough questions, and also could you incorporate a lot of the as far as what's going on in the female um um so could could i please right? ask him some tough questions yes yeah, so John, disrespectful is sound right there what was that yes yeah, so disrespectful is sound right there please just ask him some tough questions <laughs> i have re i have interviewed this man uh, let, let me speak let me speak let me speak seems it seems as if you you don't know me doing interviews Everybody said that I should interview more people because I've asked them tough questions and I've made them speak spoken matters. So what you see me as a ballsless in the individual I'm um, to not ask questions. That's what you're saying. You're putting my credibility out there down to the ground. <laughs> Hello, <you> sir. <laughs> yes, I'm hearing you. I'm asking. This is, this, this is going to be my first. What's up, what's up with this phone? His phone. Um, and you guys told me that America has the, the best internet. Lies. Lies. America doesn't have the best internet at all. Because this man's internet ain't even working. <laughs> Make the man run. <laughs> okay, it, it look like um, the boss... Um, phone not working. American internet is not um, the best people, all right? All right, so you will, call, you will call back, though. You call back, yeah? 
But he, he, he been bought me out in the chat, you know, from early. So let me call someone else. So he... Yeah, we call 50-50. Um, you know, 50-50 okay, that call. I don't know where he gets these names from, you know. Hello, sir. What are you doing? <laughs> yes, yes, I'm, I'm, I'm telling people that I don't know if you get to sleep. And I don't know where you get these names from, you know. You get... You, <laughs> and and 50, 50, 70, 70 and all of those things, you know? Hey, listen, JD. Earlier in the show when you start, right? Mm-hmm. Um, you were talking about his injuries and I was reading the comment section and it looked like some of the regular boys fans feel entitled to the goal, um, to the Nations League, right? <laughs> um, winning the game tomorrow and some people were, seemed, it seemed to me that they were coaching, I mean, they were cursing Coach Hargrims, right? Yes. And I'm saying to myself, even with the strongest squad, JD, we still weren't favourites. However, maybe we we could make the argument that um we should put up a, a we could get a result against the United States more with a stronger squad. You know, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. the possibility would be higher. But seeing that the squad is so depleted now, right? Especially hearing the news about Mikel Antonio. The possibility of even beating the United States tomorrow even makes it a uphill battle. It is even Harder, you know what I'm saying, JD. And going into this game, even with the strong squad, JD, my expectations were lowered. Reason being, I look at the um qualifiers coming up as well as the Copa America as being more important. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I was using the the, the Concacaf Nations League as a building block for the team, JD, as well as any other additions to the team to get this um form of cohesiveness, etc., so that we could do good in the, the qualifiers as well as in the Copa America, you know? So, if, if, if we can go there tomorrow and play well and we lose, God forbid, because I'm not, I'm not, honestly, Jay, I don't think we win, right? But we, we don't, we know that football is not played on paper, you know? But if we can go there and get a result tomorrow and we win and beat the United States, then that would be good, you know what I'm saying? But if we go there and lose, then I won't be saying, oh, Coach Hargibs and he that and we must left and when him left, who we replace him with? We go start all over again and knock down everything we we'll build and start from scratch again. You know what I'm saying? Because any other body else, any any other um coach that come in, they're going to want their um players. You know what I'm saying? They're mm-hmm. going to want different people that's already in the national team. You get what I'm saying, JD? Mm-hmm. And that not really make no sense at this moment in time. You see, if we go to Copa America and or I said the World Cup qualifiers come up and realize that Coach Hargrims had to be a foolish system. Then we can't say, no, so we got to go move on from Hargrims. You know the way that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, but but um, I, I, that's, I, that's what I think. Um, because I, I've, I, a person just sent me. Um, okay, now I understand why they were talking about um people talking about um overseas players is not committed. Yeah, yeah, but... um. Bruh, I don't even read the, I don't even listen to these people sometimes. You know, they don't make any sense. So I'm, 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 they don't even send these people video to me, my people. I'm telling you, let me on the internet scrolling and I check videos. You know, but don't send me those things. Cause if, if you see something I want to click it, um, you should not be telling me um that I should be clicking it. No, if I see something that I don't like, I don't click it. Just like if you see my video and I don't like it, you don't click it, you know? Um, remember, YouTube, YouTube is a space for people to benefit off, you know? And sometimes people kind of feel like, oh, if they urge, urge the fans, them, the fans them will click and, and those stuff. So they, they make more money. So some of them don't even believe in... I don't even think some of them even watch football. I honestly believe that. I don't think um, some of them actually um, watch is... They, they don't watch the football. I don't think them... I can tell you in this space, I don't think... We have three seasoned person who have YouTube channel to watch football. I don't believe so. Because you cannot talk like this and you watch football. You know? You see, JD, some of them are saying, who want to feel entitled? I almost feel entitled to beating the United States or winning the Nations League. We don't need to beat Mexico properly. Uh, we're always struggle against them and Panama. You know them where they... Um, so we, 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 we never... Come from. It's like them just... Look on the paper and say, oh, we have Leon Bill, Sherman, Nicholas, Michael, and Tony. You know what we're going to say? Uh, but I, but I've, expi- I've, I've explained, Carl, I've explained something to, 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 you, to you guys yesterday. Um, for four years I've been here struggling to figure out why these guys eat overseas players so much. And guys, in history, 
all of them, all, almost all of the, the YouTube channels, they were uh, uh, with quotas. They were always, already, always with quotas. They just changed their modes now. But they were always, already with quotas. And, it, and every single time they tried to flirt with the quota system and them stuff there. So they were all, already with it. Um, but I, I looked, I've looked at myself and said, okay, why am I so different? And I was born in Jamaica. And the only thing, the, no, let, let, no, let me explain, let me explain, let me explain. And the only thing that is different with me, and everybody that I've always heard spoke on Jamaica football, is I have never run from any competition. I, when I talk to Tati Kalem, um in a YouTube, um, they don't seem like they are better than me. So it's a low, uh, is a is an insecurity in in these people general self is the problem. They don't believe that they are good enough. So they, they don't believe in them own self. They might come across um, big chest and stuff, but they don't believe in themselves. They don't believe that they speak well. They don't believe that they're educated enough. So the, what they have to do is try to remove competitions at all times. So because they believe that, they want to put down the same thing on their football. And the difference is, I don't believe that I'm not educated enough. I don't believe that I'm not good enough. I believe that I can always compete. And I believe that if I, I deserve it, I should get it. And I'm going to work hard for it. And that was the difference. And from I've noticed that, I don't really follow people directly um, on this conversation anymore. But before, it usually affect me because I'm saying, well, I'm team fool, fool people, man. But me stop look at it that way, people. Because I believe this is the difference. The reason why I'm so different is because I believe um, that I'm good enough to get the job done. So I don't have to um, force out anybody. You understand me? You see, pertaining to what you just said, Jenny. Let me tell you. You're, you're way older than me, right? And you know, say. And stop saying I'm way older than you. I'm 45 years old, eh, big man? I am older than you, but stop saying I'm way older than you. Oh my God. Uh, you know, I'm so old. But listen, <laughs> you know, say, a couple years ago, JD, I, you see, when people plant seeds in your head, JD, mm -hmm. you're bound to certain notions. I know that a couple years ago, though, I used to say, oh, men I want to um, find money play for Jamaica because I felt like they weren't committed. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I felt like they used to use Jamaica, etc. I know, says, until I broke up on the, the, the Jamaican YouTubers like Ryan and you, etc. Mm -hmm. Where one time I went on Ryan's show and, and I said something about Mikel and Tony, how me did say, um, he never want to play for Jamaica, right? And Ryan corrected me and he said, yo, Bala, a long time when I want to play for um, Jamaica and the JFF, um, you know, Ray, 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 and um, never really get the money and something. Yes, mm -hmm. because, and when I started to realize these things and understand... And the fox is there, you know, the fox is there when he meet him tell us yeah, and turn him down, you know. It's not used, they don't want to use Jamaica or anything like that, Jed. It's that we never have a good program running or whatever. I'm just get friends like I said. Me as a Jamaican, even being born in Jamaica, me no more than a man who um, have Jamaican um, national, um, heritage, who have two yes. Jamaican friends over England. You know, they're mm -hmm. not more than that man. So I, I used to, no, I stopped thinking about them using Jamaica. If we, if we call for Omar Hutchinson or Arabala and we don't have the country, then fine, we can't beat them up, Jed. We can't go say, oh, the man. At this Jamaica, rare, rare, rare. The man just now play for Jamaica. The man just now play for Jamaica. Anybody who can, if if they want to come to the program and they come, fine. You know what I mean. Mm -hmm. But I have nothing um against the the the, the foreign ball of them that have Jamaican heritage and um Jamaican breast because I have people in my family, JD, who recently born in America who have Jamaican parents. So mm -hmm. we can look for me later and say, yeah, no Jamaican. We can't go tell them that. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Feel that? You don't know, but if man start playing football and want to represent Jamaica in the next couple years, I'm going to tell man, say, yo, you can't play in Jamaica because you're not born in Jamaica. No, so I I, I um, take those seeds that were planted in my head and start to think differently about the situation. And I don't know if track and field is a good comparison, JD, but correct me if I'm wrong, right? You know, Jamaica, track and field, right? Mm -hmm. In Jamaica, we don't have the, the best resources, like the infrastructure, etc. However, we still have um some of the fastest runners um, that we um are you sure that we don't have the best resources? No, when I mean resources, well, I mean the infrastructure itself. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, I think science, like science, they have um, kind of indulged in science a little bit more because they have more money. But I think Jamaica is one of the most, um, one of the best developed places when it comes down to track and field, like the resources. They just don't have like United States, but for the rest of the world, they can compete with the rest of the world, if not better than a lot of places in the rest of the world. But, but, but that's what I mean, Zuri. you know, like how oh, oh, whenever we perform good um, other countries, I say, yo, how the German can they perform so good, rare, rare, Like, is it the young or whatever the case is? But you see how um, in Jamaica we can produce these talents daily without um, not having uh, the adequate stuff like some other countries who mm -hmm. think that they should be way better than us. I'm saying, if we can build from home, JD, and compete against the world, whenever um, runners come from um, Jamaican, um, um, runners who have Jamaican heritage come and represent the country, I don't see nobody chastising them and say, hey, because once someone uh, um, win two races in a JD, nobody not going to say, get and, and look at the difference. You know why the difference? Because these people believe that they can compete with others. So education exactly. over a period of time, um, education of a period of time changed those set of people. So that clearly tells you, um, the, the runners believe that they can compete, so they don't have that infraction of fighting, even though I still believe that it's there, you know, to some extent, you know. But at the same time, they are much more educated on it. And I heard people talk um, on track and field in Jamaica, and to tell you, they are more educated than football. And that is just a fact. Exactly. So, when Brenda Williams come and represent Jamaica, I think she's born in America. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I have many other them. You still have, no, you still have, you still have people. You still have people because I heard people publicly yeah, do that. It's not as in football. Jamaica. No, no. In football, in football, it's terrible. Jamaica, ring, ring, ring. Yes, in football, it's, it's terrible. Like, you know? But, but we still, we, we, um, 50 50, we still see it a few times. So, what that tells me, it's in our DNA. It's in our DNA to just fight other people that we think is slightly better. What we perceive, you know, not that other people them tell you anything, you know, but what we perceive to be better, we seem to don't want to go against the competition. That is what our new set of DNA kind of scripts. You know, I don't think that was our DNA before because what I knew Jamaica on was we are going to fight until the last day, you know, but um, and we accept any challenges as well. But then nowadays DNA changed to we accept no challenges, we kill the competition. And then we don't have to have no competition. We just walk past and freely. I think, that's, I think that's probably like a societal thing in a JD where nobody wants to compete again with what is around them. You know them with it? It's almost like I am here first and I should be given everything. So in terms of like the quota system and the local player them, oh no, local man, they must do a national team because uh, we are the real deal, we are the real man, them, you know what I mean? Yes, and yes. People need to differentiate football with a lot of sports. You see, football is really the, 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 the educational aspect of it, it's different. And you know what is funny? The man they want to advocate for the local ball, they cock up that national team, right? Mm -hmm. The same local ball, they will left the JPL and go overseas and go back to the JPL. The same man, they go for an interview every day and tell them, so people, the educational aspect I did not receive in the JPL. So when I go overseas, struggle. So all the money were going to the national team to compete against Brazil, Argentina, United States, Mexico, mm -hmm. and all these other countries. When the coaching education um, that they've received is higher, especially at a younger age. 50-50. Well, it's not going to cut it. Hear this brother named Brain Drain. Competitions... Competition is for loser. Eliminate your competition if the goal is to win. So just eliminate the competition so he can't even enter the competition. <laughs> Brain drain is something else, you know. One second, one second, 50, 50, 50. And a person asks a question right here. Say, who don't don't believe that they speak well? Um, dirty Harry, Dirty Harry. Um, every time we, someone come and speak and, and try to deliver something um, good about an, an football, I heard... Mr. Bula come. Why you come here speak is spoken um, and I go like you better than people? I saw him did that on several programs and I saw several um, other personnel. They, they say, oh, oh, when you come here, you not go on better than people. When you come here, you know, speak patwa and all them something. Um, they, they, dirty are those things happen. You are here from day one. So why would you ask me who don't believe that they speak well? I am telling you, it's because they don't believe they speak well. While, why, why they have a problem with someone coming to speak? So I'm trying to show you in their makeup, they are not fighters. They are weak people. That's what I'm trying to go um, go with. And I, and the facts is there before. And I know you know you just wanted 
to me maybe see if I was going down a different path. But I was going down this path, the exact path, and I thought 50 50 understood what I was saying. And everyone in the chat understood what I was saying. That is just a fat man. You get me? Well, they, they believe that the other guys are better. Because even look at the reporter the other day, 50 50. I don't know if you remember this one. When the reporter come up and I say, Al Grimson, so what is saying to make them money a train and you're not going to pick them? Al Grimson just saying the last sentence, you know. Say, we are look for people, we have the potential and show that they want the opportunity and we give them a chance. And uh, she, she said, this is what make up in the man head, you know. The insecurity in the man head, you know. The man already come out. So, you, so that means uh, the, the man had just asked the question, you don't hear nothing what the man just said. You just have your question for us and don't care what the next man ask, you will come ask the same question. So the man have looked at him good and said, okay, but I think they have to play for it and um, I just said, um, people are playing for their positions. So the man just said to him, you know, but through him and him and maybe him friend them want to make the team and him feel like him friend him not going to make the team and look how life funny now, 50-50, him not going to come back and say, Al Al Grimm say a true man to him word. Because, because him select um the youth or him select um Dixon him select uh, my boy as goalkeeper him select King, and all of them are through them performance over the overall thing. You understand me? Yeah, it, but me I try to show you all them stay big boss. So them never change fifty fifty. They will never it's change. Because um, not nothing what the the coach says or anyone says they are willing to change, even if the facts present itself. And JD, you see like. You have people who stay away where if you present the facts, JD, because the insecurities are, I don't know what it is, or this defense mechanism, or because they don't want shame or whatever the case is, they will put up a strong wall to block whatever the facts are, JD. And some people just stay so true, like, and you can't change them. You get my JD? So even if the facts present itself, say, maybe this guy isn't good enough for the national team. Just because I'm on the right I'm going to say the man I fight out the man thing, and the man bad mind the man. Mm -hmm. and it does, it does not make sense it just doesn't make sense so you, that means you're pretty much saying that that's why we can't have conversations anymore it's like a dictatorship it is hard okay. because you know JD I made a video recently explaining the word bad man JD <laughs> oh my god conversation, right? and I critique someone how can you say that I'm bad man JD really and truly when we really bad man the man over if we said the man not have a right to tell the man is inadequate in it's just your assessment towards a specific yeah. part of the person's game. Mm -hmm. so you can't critique people. You can't critique nothing in life which you can give me a JD. Okay, okay. If you do it, you have a bad man. But I will leave you with that. Bless up. Alright, respect, respect. Yeah man, yeah man, yeah man. Ask the man some real person big boss you know, you know that i don't do interviews don't you know that i don't do interviews don't but anytime i do interviews people people say me good at it because mr butler um them say the best interview mr butler ever had on the internet and me and him have it but he, he so don't doubt my skills don't doubt my skills me no run from no competition, all right? As what we, as what we just, my, my, my relish challenges. Me no kill the competition. My relish challenges. 50-50, 70-70. So good conversation, Big Boss. And we will um, get Mr. Bo Mr. Speed to talk. Because we, we, we don't have a person in prison. We want him to talk, all right? Yes. So you will see it later. You never may know, all right? Big up. All right, so we have some super chat. Hold on before we go anywhere because the people put their money, so I can't disrespect them. The brain drain put um, a few super chats. Well, um, Antonio knows there they knows there will be a slaughter. Oh God, the brain drain have no feet. All right, so and we have Moses said we all know United States is a big big favorite in this game, but remember Argentina was a big big favorite over Saudi Arabia and they lost um two to one in the World Cup. Yeah, but they end up the window in their World Cup in you know, Moses, so that tells you say um the chances of them slipping up was very very slim. All right, let me make sure to pin pin Moses super chat because the man put in money. Massive respect for the super chat and brain drain. Uh, it's not a favoritism of the super chats, but I just feel like say if the man put fifty dollars 
um, I should keep his thing right here and people can challenge it for a little bit longer. All right. So don't take it disrespectful. As you know, you know my thing already, brain drain. Okay, I can't pin it. All right, so I can't pin it at this point, but I'm going to try to see if I can get it pinned. Okay, it, it looks like it's only my things, but I can start the super chats, so they will stay there. I will start them, all right? Yes. Um. Yeah, was the game in Saudi Arabia, Christian, like how the game it will be in USA? Yes. Oh, it's pinned already. Okay, thank you. They said it's pinned already off its own. All right. Yes. Yeah. So, um, yeah, good, good question. Um, the one was in the, the, the vicinity um, that favors the personnel that wanted to be the underdog or was actually the underdog. So what we have to do right here is to say that everything is stacked against Jamaica and we have to just fight hard, you know, and that's what we, we have been saying for the entire um, conversation. Agree. 50 is more. Yes, 50 is more, but I, I've been everyone. Um, yo, JD, you know, easy. No, no, no. I had to make sure. I, I have to give people respect and, and I'm straightforward. Brindrian is the heaviest donator on my platform. The heaviest one. Um, the last time I've embarrassed him um, because he acted like he had more money than me. So I had to go over um, to Simon Preston and make him the most money he ever made in, on YouTube. You know, yes, I make it rain, but um, Mr. Brain Drain run out, run out of money. He said he had to go back to work. <laughs> yes, because every time he comes on my platform, I pin up himself um, and I had to smoke him to tell him that, um, you know, I don't I don't exalt myself, but I, I will embarrass you, you know, when it comes on to donation. You know, yes, but he he kind of picked himself back up because when when we had donated for the girl, um, he puts up some big money. Um, he was the only one that matched me close to the big money, but it was five percent of what I put. He put so he's not in my league, people. Brain drain is not in my league. He's just a show off. When Katark was running um that channel, there was a lot of money pull up. No, 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 no. I was the one that brought the money there. It wasn't him. And he was an embarrassment, just an overhype individual that put $15 to the biggest charity that ever assembled on YouTube. $15. When Brain Drain put a $50, I put, what, $1,000 um, ad, and several other men put $100, $100. So Brain Drain um, and Cataract was embarrassment to their oligarchs status. <laughs> Sorry, brain drain. I never meant to out you out like that, you know. But yes, <laughs> maybe <laughs> he's gonna be upset now. You know, <laughs> big up 50 50. You have improved, yeah, man. 50 50. If you present information to him, um, he will change. Believe me, all right, yes. <laughs> so brain drain very sorry i just brought up history to make people know that you are not in my league when it comes on to donation you know um yes only only guzman could have challenged me only guzman and i still smoke guzman as well too cranky came up tell me that i should not bet anything that i can't afford to lose and I've smoked Cranky as well. So I am the biggest donator around the place. Um, maybe if I knew um, the, the girl, it would be would have been a different. I don't tip. I pay bills. Ooh! The man has show off. <laughs> so guys, this is a money war now. The man, he, his excuse, his excuse why I smoked him. Um, he can't, oh, the reason why I never put any more money was solely because I don't know the girl. But you are the head um, personnel of the one Jamaica gang and the girl wanted to represent Jamaica. Um, brain drain spend, um, spend about a thousand a month on, on YouTube and Super Chat. Him, him just pace it out. Yes, but I, I had paid that one time. <laughs> yes. And what happened? No, no, no. I was just, I was just smoking brain drain because he's out here hyping bow. Oh, if I knew the girl, big money would have been spending. <laughs> oh my God. So brain drain, admit that you had gotten defeated. Don't follow the, the thing that we just talked about and, 
and find an excuse. Say the next time around, um, you will be better at delivering um, the competition. Um, Brando, understand the economics of the situation. <laughs> so what are you saying? I went over to chat him out Cataract's cat channel and I dropped three bills. And you guys ran competition with me and he got like a thousand. I came over my platform and dropped one thousand, one, one brick. And um, I never talked about scattering out money. And I had several other 10 ten dollars. I think I dropped two bills over tactical channel as well too. So, um, Brindrian, you're you have done well. Respect it, but you, you you have to understand that there is competition. There is levels to this. All right. Um, JD, how does Butler name gets in this money conversation? But nobody never called Mister Butler name. Um, we were talking about Cataract when he claimed that he bought a Simon's channel, which is a lie. You know, <laughs> and my ear can can grow back. Not sure about JD. So what happened to my ear? You know, see my ear and my head. <laughs> um, Cataract will find his way back over here. No, 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 no. That can't happen. I have um, removed that human being from um, my memory. Months ago, so he can't he can't come to big bad top 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 level places that people who don't pretend like they have it. They just spend it. No chattings. They just spend it. You know. Yes. Big up Moses. Big up Brain Drain. Big up Jason. Big up Jason Guna. Um. Big up Sports on the Ball. Yeah, man. Um. Yeah. JD a choppy line. No, no, no. I work hard for my things. You know. All right. Um. Jason. Jason. I just um, got the thing finished today um, because uh, we, have, we have to go to the bank for them to do the insurance and everything. So um, the boy, uh, last week the boy tell me, so the three weeks started last week. So two weeks or maybe the next weekend, I will get the, the van. All right. So hold me to that. Yeah. I want to make sure you know. All right. Yeah, man. So make it done today. Um, um, no, no, Zay. I know, no, Zay. I, I don't, I don't really watch uh, much channels, you know. Um in my sleeping time when i do wake up and if it comes past um no i've not sold my house see i'm still upstairs i'm um, in the studio uh, i've not sold those i will sell those next year next year uh, when we accumulate more funding um to go for the next one we're not gonna pretend like we have too much you know <laughs> um brain Jane said he bought a hotel and a car with and this money full trap um you believe none of that bs um brain Jane? you believe none of that you believe none of that? <laughs> that, man, that man is the biggest con man you can find. Cataract should go on, open his own YouTube channel. And because when JT runs him, he won't have anywhere else to go. Yes, I thought he got run, he, he got run from Ryan. He got run, I think he started out at Ryan. Ryan and, Ry and Simon. Um, and then he got moved up from both of them, then he go to the coach's desk, then he came over here, then he goes to Manning's man that he says he doesn't like, then he's over, he's over, over JT, you know, you said, um, yeah, and uh, that's it, you know, and then he's gonna, him and Mr. Anderson, him and Mr. Anderson might just open a YouTube channel soon, <laughs> because they might need the funding from the YouTube channels, you know, <laughs> yeah. oh, Jason, go on TV next, okay, <laughs> Jason Guna TV next. Yes, yes. <laughs> no, Antonio. Another disappointment. More. Um. So Jamaica will lose to USA. Premier Seven. Why every day you come here? I try add the number of goals we we are gonna concede. Yes, sir. We are gonna lose already. You never have to tell me again. All right. The builder should build a YouTube channel. Um. Well, know yourself. Um. Cataract have not built no YouTube channel. Not make him tell the foolishness. All right. Yes, he will come here. Cataract will, will con. Cataract is the biggest trapper in Jamaica. I can say that. He's the biggest trapper in Jamaica. All right? Yes. <laughs> Cataract is like seasoned girl. Manning cup every time. Oh my. <laughs> oh my God. Will you go to Netherlands? Of course, me not tell you, Sean. Me not tell you, I go to Netherlands. Me not have to use my car, Sean. Me not use my wife's car. Um... And she can keep my car here because I don't want the mileage to go upon it because I already um, committed to sell them the car. 
All right, I've already committed to selling the car at that mileage, so I'm not gonna take because what a 150, 150 back and forward, so 300 um kilometer, 300 kilometer. I don't want to put on so much on it, so I'm gonna just drive the next car. But I, I will be there though. All right, <laughs> Raymond and this is not a chopper. All right, hello, good day, Rika Dano. Um, what one? We are burned down the building you. <laughs> you're, you're live in a Rika Dano. What go on? What go on, big boss? Can you, you call me and sleep on the phone? I want to bring you, man. See me about in the building. Sorry, bro. I never realized you. So you call me and never realize you're yeah, asleep then? <laughs> oh, no, oh, no, no, no. Let me tell you. You know, there's something you put in um, the earbuds, them, brother, because of Bluetooth. So, like, when we take it out, even though we just have to take it out and, and disconnect the Bluetooth, it, it hang up the card. Okay, okay, okay. So, what you want to add to the show? Because I'm coming to the end, you know. And you call in right at the end of the show. Oh, my. Oh, them. Rika Dan, the Rika Dan, just, just, just go and do your thing, big boss, you know. And stop this respect my program um, by, by calling and hanging up. Then, then stop use Bluetooth, Rika. Jesus, God, man. Me know. Me know, but me, 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 me not have the Bluetooth. <laughs> So I want to not be being penalized for not having a Bluetooth. Yes. So why you want to add to the pro program, you know? Because me know it's a later program, you know. You know, I miss the one there. We miss the speed, you know. No, 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 I miss it, man. I miss it. But no, I'm just me disappointed to Antonio, old brother. Um, Boy, bro, me want to talk tough, but me not think we stand a chance. But me still have to live in a hope, brother. Me have a hope so we win. We can pull off a little miracle, a minor miracle, but um, we don't want to guess up get our too much in a bro. But we, we you see, one thing we know, you know, mm -hmm. in the side of cataract, you know, so the side they guarantee for lose, bro. <laughs> <laughs> them, them, they start them, start them, start them, start them. You know what? The, the, the song that I'm a rune sing, but I'm a just start that I get out, brother. You see, from the man tell you X, you see, if the man tell you turn right, if you want to see your life, go left. Yeah, man. What you say? What you say? You sure know, say, uh, God, you are fine over the left. <laughs> Brother, may I tell you? Yo, my G, let me tell you this, bro. The man go up on another channel and name out the, and list out the whole Anderson strategy, bro. I laugh till my week. Okay. Me say, at this, at this time, man, I say, I'm a master from England. Okay. <laughs> Oh my god. So, I, I think you should stay you should stay as a selector. Just stop try everything else because I don't think you're good at nothing else more than selecting. Raymond a madman. Raymond a madman for <laughs> really have cataract in him camp, brother. But you know, realize up here, can man Raymond sign team team. Everybody uh, my boy from Harborview, can man. Uh, Mr. Butler, can man. Cataract, can man. They are all the same type of version people, you Every day I'm one of them are the same thing, you know, just listen to the whole them talk. Let me just can can you out. Um, my boy, uh, when I'm going to Carvel Stewart, um, Mr. Okay, Butler, and, uh, and Cataract, the whole of them are the, all three of them are the same thing. All three of them are the exact thing. Same thing. thing. Yeah, man, all three of them, man, believe me, man. They have everything in common. And you know why I lose after that, brother? Because he was the man we are talking about one Jamaica with me and a champion, one Jamaica. Um, you know, yeah, but from me. From me, from me here, in the opposite side, me I said, are you there? Damn. You know? Boy, so, like, nothing not Jamaica like, not real then. You know? And that, it make me feel like nothing real. Like, nobody not believe in nothing. And nobody not stand for nothing. You know? When me I listen to him, you know? I said, wow. The youth are different, you know? One week, you say, yo, no local ball, no forgetting a team. And as soon as the coach of the local team, when you never know me, no, call him out of the coach and say, brother, stop that bad body with them, man. 
and call him up oh. up long there. Him start talk about local baller. Um, oh, every man we come true now. And re- brother, you know for stay some man. Stand up balls, man. Have something called balls, man. You know? Yeah, man. So we can't reach me to give you like that. To be fair, you know, you know, step on the channel, enough man they are calling him out and I say, yo, what kind of switch up is this? Like, Katar, why you don't really do this when you yeah, say one thing, you don't say the opposite. And so, but, but bro, I just have to say, we're not interested for hearing what I'm going to say now, you know. Uh, well, me know I hear him officer no. Rico, me know I hear him officer. And me think you can hear him officer. Rico, you can hear him officer. Rico, you can hear him officer because you tell me say I'm gonna stalk it out. So does any way you see him, he'm gonna tell you where him officer. That I want no thing you know I got him. Okay. No man, Catrack will never come back on the show, man. I mean I tell him never come back, you know. I never know that we are running. You know. I mean, tell me if I come back here. No, but me the one people who he miss. And you see it? You see it turn out? Turn out? Everybody running my way after that. You must see me see me go over money's man them. And then I bought me out to me a big clown. Which part what part of me a clown? Um you never give me nothing, you never me never beg you nothing, you don't know nothing about me Dan. You understand me? <laughs> and me can't say the other way around. So um don't 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 do them something me hear you talk. And you're a disappointment. To everything, all appearance them. <laughs> Brother, the man switch for anything. Anything him switch for, that may tell you. Anything him switch for. You know? Anything. Clearly, if you give him money and tell him, say, um, a Jamaica have the best football ever that he's gonna say. Big nail, big nail kid become the best kid in a Jamaica, the best midfielder in a Jamaica because I am I'm, I'm grand can mentor him because his father one of the richest in a in a Jamaica. Yeah, you see, so every action tell me, say, I just went things that the man is there, straight up. Yeah, I'm, I'm so back. Him have a price. Yeah, man, he have a price, man, straight up, man. I'm can't, I'm, I'm only can't come and dispute that because of the action of your own mouth, me listen to. You understand me? Yeah. Yes, and, and yeah. it tells me opposite to what you you had stood for. Me still are there a champion one Jamaica. You know why? I'm a no say the truth. Because Mr. Speed them come around and say that is the only way. You know why? Because statistical proof come and say that is the truth. America have only two MLS players for them team. Because them feel like the metric is not ad in their favor. So we know the truth. Me not could have sell, sell up my channel and say, yo, I want to promote a be a local bar, I promote cars. I know I'm going to get some whole heap of clicks. I'm going to talk the truth. If I see a player good today, me not going to come tell you no foolishness. You get me? Straight up. <laughs> But we gotta bring that up in our JD because you see how fast USA learn. Remember when up here you know, in you know, for 2018 when the man try to qualify in the JD. Mm-hmm. Remember them new one, it was only MLS ball. And then don't make it for 2018 World Cup, but it's so, but so them get burned one time in our JD. Mm-hmm. Man them get burned one time. And that's the idea that them switch it up fast. Yeah. We need to learn just as fast, but me, me wanna say. One thing before me go, you see, you see, um, Qatar, one thing, one, Qatar can move up here. You yeah. see, you have to understand that Jamaica is a cross-section of people. And, and everybody, they get a chance to go to school. I was fortunate, you get me, I say, you have an advanced degree. The way I see you with a little man from the channel, because it's obvious that the man is educated, right? Okay. But just because you're not educated does not mean that you don't have a high IQ. You get me, I say? Mm-hmm. I think. I, my grandfather can, could have probably be a spelling name, but the man they have much land and house and all that. So yeah. So which one? Which one, So before I go there, which one is more? Which one is more fuller? A super educated person that makes dumb decisions over and over, or the, the man where don't educated at all, and he keeps on making the right decision because he waits until um the cream rises to the crop. Which one? The one when I, when I educated. All right. Thank you very much. No, 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 no. And, yeah, so stop, stop, do that to people, brother. Cause you could have said the man feel a way, JD. You get me? I say you have to understand. Say you might get the opportunity, but another man might be the oldest in the same family, and he have to go work early. His parents might never have it. Yeah, facts, so facts, facts, facts. Go into it. Facts. Don't, don't disparage people because of them education or lack of education. Facts. It's not right. And we don't want to call the man and blast him the day because he could have said. Get her up, but the man feels small energy. Yeah? Okay. I don't like those things, baby. I okay. don't like it, brother. 
Yeah, yeah man. It's evil. It's her. Well, I'm going to hear this, you know. I'm going to hear this because I'm friend of my clip it already and I send it to him because they have to keep on bringing information. Yeah. Of course, I'm going to see it. I'm going to see it, man. Of course, man. I saw them. I mix up, I mix up space, you know. So I'm going to see it, of course. Yeah, man, and, and they need to see it as well. So, um, as what well, I'm saying, one thing you can learn: um, don't disrespect no other, don't don't disrespect no other um, um, persons, and act like you you're brighter than them. You know, or you know, give them the chance to get get information across. It's you know, do better. All right. It's not right. And one day we are joke and call the man gelding and the man got you know, feelings and like. Ready for crying, man. Like, you know, everybody so, just be a joke. So, so if you can, if you can dish it out, if you can, di make sure you can take it, if you can dish it out. But me a girl didn't too, me never take it no way. Me never take it no way. So, I don't know, bro. But it means for the better panda. But, brother, I'm gone. And All right. Show, what time are the, what time are the speed it, things? It's set already, you know, you just click on it and tell you the time from your location. Because that's a YouTube. Oh, all right. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right, so me okay, okay. Well, 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 well. Well, let's block chef. Chef, chef has said some things in our chat. People, remove chef from the conversation. He's not. He's not going on well. Time out, chef. Ah, uh, yeah, chef. You have to be hidden from this channel. You're acting to be different. All right. <laughs> chef is. Chef is. Chef is too too spicy. You know. <laughs> May I call in? No man, you can call. You can yeah, you can call in the next time. This is not the time for calling now, cause me want to wrap up the the channel. The, the thing for get some rest and eat some food. Me never eat the food as it you know. Yeah man, so I say people. Um, me stand on business and stay exactly in my lane. And this is my lane where me just talk about football. Me watch the games and keep people update, and they will just move on. You understand me? Yes. What wrong thing in my cook up? Yes, the chef the chef is on the wrong side of life. <laughs> um people please do hit the like button, share and um subscribe. Alright, yeah, get the likes up. We have 180 still here in the morning. Yes, Michael Antonio, um Western printed that is out. Alright, he's out. We have to watch the games. Um and he dropped on his shoulder and look and he was in extreme discomfort. If you're watching the game, all right, now you have learned, you go there and check for yourself. So um, I, 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 I saw him continue, so I wasn't sure if it it was um, something that leaded to um, a decision. But maybe it's something of that or maybe it's something pop up, pop up. So what you would do, don't try to look at the irras irresponsible people that maybe don't have the information, but they come to sell narratives to make you believe that they are in the know of anything but their main interest is to tear down the one jamaica when they are pretending like they are a proponent of that one jamaica all right yes because the information is there for yourself so I always take an extra time to just read a little bit more all right yes just read it a little bit more and maybe the truth is there because the people in their foreign them not have nothing for either um for jamaica because jamaica now do nothing for them and that is just a real fact Nothing else. Jamaica now do nothing for them. So, them tell you what exactly happened. And Jamaica could have sued them via the FIFA route if they don't get the players them here. Yeah. So, just put those mathematics together and you realize for yourself. All right? Reading is fundamental. Um, Jason says, well, I guess it's not fundamental at all. You know? <laughs> Propaganda is, is, is front of the line. You know? Yeah. But he's out. Um, and it's going to be a tough time. Um, a tough time for Jamaica, so let me just wish them on, support the, the boys them, and as we said, we are trying to aim towards getting clarity to a lot of things, not just having a bag of streams for no reason. All right, yeah, man. So the whole heap of people who support the, the, the stream today, massive respect, and the people that donated, massive respect as well. All right, because you take your time and put every dollar, every dollar that you put on these channels, um, it's like a thousand views from certain region, especially if majority of the view fan base is from Jamaica, which my I am glad I, I not I'm, I'm not glad, but it's not for me. It's not. So every dollar you put on the channel, it's like an extra thousand views you have posted. So I am grateful for it, all right? You're going to see the players them. Sean, that's what I'm waiting on. I'm waiting on Dion Brunnings. Um, I, I think I, ta I tagged him and said I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see the players them. So, and I'm going to lock off one of my phones to make sure I have at least a phone running. Or I'm going to bring my extra camera 
and see if I can get some interviews. But I think you guys have to go to them and let them know that I'm going to be there. Yeah, because I, if I don't have any pass, oh, I'm going to do interviews. You know? So get to, get to um, um, Brunnings and tell him that I'm going to be there. Um, so I can get the interviews them and, and such, you know? Because obviously, um, I am the popular superstar for Suriname. You know? So now I'm going to be there. I should be doing these interviews. You understand me, Sean? Yes. You guys can't let me out in the let left me out in the dust like that to be driving for five million miles to can't get no interview, you know? <laughs> Can Bibi still play? Well, we are gonna find out, you know. Alright? The man the man still look young, you know? Big big baller. Who is the replacement? We're not sure. Yes, Sean, so um I have to call um Dian. Um I'm gonna call him when I'm done and tell him, say, listen to me, man. Man alright, I'm gonna ride for ten thousand miles. I'm going to need to be talking to some of these players because I'm going to dust out a lot of money to come and watch Suriname. So, I need to make my money. All right? <laughs> Big sports journal. Yes, man, of course, man. The last time I went to um, um, Zimine's game, you know, this is me of the highest quality uh, recordings from the game. <laughs> All right? Even warm up quality I had, you know? Yes, man, I, I, I go there and do my job, man. You know? But it, it looks like it's going to be nice, um, Sean. I hope I do see Rainel. Rain um, if I do see Rainel, maybe he can get some interviews done. Um, because it looks like they do, they do already know some of the players. them, And whatever he gets and I do get, um, we can put them together and put them out. Yes, I'm going to... Let me see if I can call him. Where's my other phone? Yeah, man, um, I, I shouldn't have a problem. If I can't get a... a, 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 a uh, a media pass for Suriname. I think um, um, Suriname need to stop playing football because that would be the extreme disrespect, you know. But I'm going to call him. Let me see Dion Burnings. See Cheryl Lebecca. Cheryl Lebecca go on with beating. People see Cheryl Lebecca here. I roll up. So that means the man already did it. So Cheryl Lebecca, I got to turn up the thing. Sure, it'll be kind of turn up the thing. All right, so we see Dion Burnings. Hey, Dion. JD here. That I am the Ed Surinamese, so please get back to me. Um, it makes sense, you remember, <laughs> JD. You need to uh, a sub office. Um, <laughs> um, the stadium sold out, really, and I never bought the ticket. Oh my god! Oh, this this is embarrassing. But if the stadium sold out. Ah, oh, man, I still can't go into that. I want to. Of course, I can still go into that. Hold on. Because Rainel did send me the ticket. You know. oh, I, so, oh, I'll rain them there on the team. And he must send me ticket to eight places. So, Rainel can't get any press pass. Yeah, man, I'm, go I'm going, people. I'm going. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if... Um, it's sold out. I will be there, Sean. And and as people know me, still, when I do come there, um, um, I'm going to make a bag of nice until I go in that stadium, one thousand percent. So I'm going in the stadium regardless. Um, man, don't in the sixty. <laughs> Andre Gray should be there. Yes, he's not in the sixty. Why I never know. Yeah, damn man, I should have kept my yeah. But it's going to be a good game, people. Um, you know, see some quality ballers. I, I'm sorry that Daniel Duki is not there because I'm talking about Daniel Duki from four or five years ago in Malaysia, Getrada. Um, I'm talking about um, Wrench. Um, I'm talking about for the longest time, you know, and some of them turn up to play for Netherlands. Majority of those guys, when I was talking about them, they were just under market value of 500,000. Yo, a lot of work I've done in this space, you know, man. 
500,000 and those market value those, those guys are there. Um, Javi Simmons, um, I'm talking about Javi Simmons before he had a market value. I know Javi Simmons is like an $80 million baller, $50 million baller, you know? Yeah, man, it's a long time. We out here scouting players, people. JD, the man them don't want the overseas base players, them. Um, but Devon Potter, you don't know that a long time, man. Um, Daniel Duki passport um, in the making. Yeah, man, anytime Daniel Duki um, gets his passport, um, I'm buying a shirt instant. Daniel Duki throwing in the back. I'm going to buy a Ni Nigeria shirt. Nigeria, Niger the Nigeria Nike them. Oh, God. Super fire. Yes, I'm going to get one of that. And, and then now... I need, um, if I get Malik Madasil, Hutchinson, um, Kadama Thierry, I'm going to build a shirt with one of them on it, you know? The players them that I've talked about. Yeah, but I should have Ethan Pinnock. I'm going to get an Ethan Pinnock shirt. And I should get a Deshaun Bernard shirt. Um, you wrote, uh, okay, okay. I think he, I don't know, I don't know. But I've skipped out that. Um, brain drain, you know? Um, don't go try jump no fence. Remember, I know Jamaica you there because we need you on YouTube. No man, no man, no. Um, DJ gigs. I uh, one thing about Suriname, no, man. I'm highly respected there. You know. Um, by later I'm gonna get the press pass, man. I'm almost certain of that. Almost certain. So I have no problem um with it. Um, our present coach is doing a fairly good job thus far. However, I think for the future we need to get a box to box coach. To help um, the team where the um, composer is concerned, okay? Buy a Bailey shirt, JD, and support the baller. I, I don't want none. I, I, I went to um, Aston Villa. My auntie is one of the big um, contributors of Aston Villa. Um, I could have gotten a shirt. Yeah. Um, my grand aunt, I should say, when I went there to England. Yeah, but I, I don't want any Bailey shirt. I'm not bad minding a Bailey. I just don't want one. I buy what I want and I, I take what I want. I just want what I want. All right? And I want my players them. So why I can't just get a Jamaican shirt? I want a Jamaican shirt different from the Pinnock shirt and um, the Deshaun Bernard shirt. I don't want any Bailey shirt. Don't care if you guys want to say I'm bad-minded. You know? Lots of Jamaicans live in Birmingham. Yes, yes, all right, a lot. Um, I need to go back there again because now I realize I could could just order food, order food. If my auntie sees this video, you know, she's gonna de dead with laugh, you know, because she, the other day she was keeping a party in the house and she said she had ox tails and everything there, um, because she's keeping her party, um, and just f for family and stuff to come, and she's saying that if JD was here, he would be eating off all the food. <laughs> Believe me, man, because she don't know how much I do pay for food in Belgium, the Jamaican food, you know. So when man's get a chance to buy food for $10, 10 euros, 10 pounds, 10 pounds, sorry, 10 pounds. Why would I turn it down, people, when I can get it for 10 pounds, you know? Yeah, every day I'm there. I'm buying food all over the place. I'm buying evil food, sending to other people. So I'm just happy to buy food. <laughs> um, Demo said, "Your bad mind. Buy, buy a Bailey pillow instead. <laughs> Get a whisper shirt. Um, uh, if they, if they, if they play for the, the national, the, the only shirt that I should have bought, and I wanted to buy it, you know, but Ziminis." Said he's going to get it to me. I, I need to get back to Mr. Ziminez and tell him to send the damn shirt that he said he's going to give the fan base. Because I was going to go to um, um, Braga, you know, um, and buy the shirt myself, you know. And Ziminez said he's going to get the shirt to me. I've not gotten the shirt, Ziminez, so I'm going to call you publicly. We need the shirt. Um, all right, yes, and we need the shirts for the, the masses and the, fa the fan base. A, lo a lot of youth I mean, in Jamaica would have wanted want a shirt. But you know what? I'm going to go there and I'm going to try and get them to print one for Ziminis. I'm going to buy two. And then I'm going to text him the two that I bought and let him send three for me. <laughs> so I'm going to get five Ziminis shirts. But I'm going to buy two myself and guilt trip him into buying three more for the fan base. Yeah, like what I do to um, um, brain drain and those guys, you know. Good morning. Um, to say, um, so, they want you to buy every jersey. Um, no, I just bought who I want, Winston. Because I said I'm buying five jerseys. 
which all of them will cost hundred um, dollars per person. And I'm gonna still buy two more Zimini shirts. I'm gonna go down there. Um, I'm gonna see if it's on the way. If it's on the way going to Ned uh, Netherlands, I'm gonna stop there and buy the shirts them um, Sunday. All right, from early because I'm gonna leave out my house like four hours before because it will take like an hour for to reach there. So if I'm gonna pass there, I could just buy the shirts them. Um, yeah. Are you saying um, they are making it hard um, for the players to come? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so guys, we have a good um, eventful um, weekend um, for you guys. So just look out. I'm going to be all over the place. Jamaica game. Then we have um, um, Eddie should be playing a game. We have Nigeria playing a game. And then I'm going to end it off with Suriname playing a game. And I'm not going to do that live because I'm going to be there live. All right, yes. Even though um, they're not going to cuss, I say, oh, me I say, I mean, who in Suriname? <laughs> yes. Sean, Sean, now, uh, sell um, Bailey, uh, the Dan, poster boy. Okay. Sean, Sean, right, you know, you sell out Suriname, you know, so don't even too talk too loud, you know. All right? Yeah. <laughs> you sell out Suriname for Jamaica. I thought you graduated um, from Suriname, man. No, no, no. I have not changed, you know. Um, Big D Len said we lose in 3 0. Oh my god. I hope when the team comes and um, bust one in the United States net. And um We had some good games, you know, that we, we we knew that we were going to we should lose the games, you know, like even Mexico in the World Cup qualifiers in Mexico, you know. Oh my god. Um Mexico hit the bar, the ball's on the line, Funes Murray, Ed, uh, Ed, eyelash on the line, the ball don't go over the line, and the game still don't finish 2-1. A peach of a ball over the top, even though I know he never meant that. Um, Shaman Nikas, uh, um, the, the error um, took place by bouncing off the play, and Shaman Nikas struck a thunderous strike um, to the top bins to make it 2-1. All right, and made it the game look a little bit competitive, but we got dominated. So I'm saying we can be still dominated um in games and still turn out to get something out of it. All right, because they cannot score a lot on the day. Obviously, Funes Morai and Balagan Pepe is not the same caliber strikers. So I'm not expecting them to sh to finish the same uh, waste so much chances. But yeah, we had several games that watch that we got dominated in, and we still stayed in the game. Um, big deal. Let's see, bro. Who else is out? All right. So who else is out for this game that we would have had in our team? Leon Bailey, one. Um, De Damari Gray, two. Um, Shamar Nichols, three. Mikel Antonio, four. Pinnock, five. Amari Bell, six. Kadama Thierry, that was listed, seven. Yeah. And that should be it, I think. That should be it. Yes, so it'll pin up. Yeah, yeah. And Tavon Gray is carrying an injury. Um, uh, he, he was injured for the longest time. So I would love to see him um, to know that he's there. Yeah, but we have um, several people out. Several people out. Brain drain, false pretense, and hype. Boy, Devon, I hope you don't go back on that word, you know. Because that I want to tell me some a bad man when I call out people. Say that they may do. But you know, only did support them. So you can't make sure you don't go up with your word and stand on it. Alright? That's on a way still, but yeah. <laughs> JD, pick a Jamaica game that you will attend when Jamaica is playing in 2024. Alright, I told um the problem why I never um attended uh, this one, this competition, the Cooper, is because my lady, my it's not everybody fan um so hyped about America, you know. It's not everybody really um hype about America. You know, so my wife really don't really like it, you know, but um, trying to explain to her that America might be a little bit better than what you saw on the TV, you know. Yeah, so we might can give it a shot, you know. <laughs> and um, I should, I, I, I'm, believe me, people, I am going to get into America one way or the other, Sherman. Because once I can escape and my wife give me the go ahead, I am going to get into America, you know. Yes. So, you know, can say me, 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 people hold me back and all sort of foolishness, you know? <laughs> um, but, yeah, yeah, once I do get to go ahead, um, remember I have to plan things. I can't just get up any day and just run away, left all of my businesses and bills and everything. You understand me? Um, America, uh, um, better, JD. 
Good. No, no, no. American are better than nowhere else. I'm to you. Um, just link me. Uh, we can have an Olympic duel. So me now, I got to try to reach America. And then Jason will terrorize me. Him not just make me know one better come America. <laughs> JD, wife come um Jamaica. She went to Jamaica before, yes. But she never go back to Jamaica. Okay, I thought you were living um living in the US. No man, what can a GSM them living in the US man? Three point contest, hundred meter, free kick challenges amongst the others. Yes. <laughs> Jesus God. <laughs> Don't make nobody make you get beaten. I know I never said I'm gonna get any beaten. Nobody said that. See, I'm going to um Netherlands. Um, but it's just because it fits in my time. So if I do come back, um I can get everything in my life go good. If I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna lose money to spend a barrage of money to go to America, you know, and I and I've not planned it out properly, you know, because maybe I have to pay people to keep my kid when my lady is at work. You understand me? So that is unnecessary expenses when all of us could have just took the, the trip just like what we did for England. You understand me? So that's why it's not good when someone don't want to come somewhere with you. You know? JD, a Europe, Europe man. Elite squad. Deli dead with love. Oh my God. I have the best jump shot here. It's not even close. Perfect shot form. All right? <laughs> All right, Olan, Olan. We have um, Detonation said, uh, we are beg for Uncle JD. Please, wifey, don't beat him. Um, I have not said anybody going to beat me. Nobody beat him. Nobody. All right? <laughs> JD, make you get um, uh, your pardon for the, uh, you to go to USA. Yeah, man. But, uh, but people, people, let me tell you this. I, am, I just bought the, the van. I am saving for additional place um, within a year. I am not making so much money on YouTube for me to be taking money out of my personal savings to stop my flow of my things to just be going all over the place and then spending more money back in Belgium to make sure I take care of the family. You guys can't see it, man. Um, I can't leave the people if they're not coming with me. All right? Yes. I am saying that with my chest. <laughs> Um, I like your channel. It's full of vibes and you treat um, all of us good. Thank you, Winston. Um, well, that's that's what we are always talking about. You know, everyone is equal. You know, um, only Brain Drain and Moses kind of separate by how much they have donated. You know, Moses got a lead over Brain Drain. <laughs> um, man's wife beating him. He can't believe. Um, he can't believe me Jamaican Brain I get beaten. Oh, <laughs> Uh, that's not happening. I'm just telling you, I'm, I'm a responsible person. Just like oh, when I'm coming on YouTube, I'm responsible. All right. If I'm have to pay um, 2000 to do this um, for two weeks and then I have to pay 7000 over a year when I could have just used that same 9000 to put towards something that will help me in the future and make you guys have a better studio. I, next house I'm going to get, it's going to have a studio by itself. So why I can't just hurry up and get that? You know, um, than you guys trying to drain my pocket. You guys not paying me. You know what? Any trip you guys want me to go on, you have to pay for that. So if the trip costs 5000 I will put 2500 and Uno put to, So every trip that you guys want me to go with, I will explain to my lady. I will put down all the, the, the expenses. It's on a no. And then I will say that I'm fitting half of it because obviously I'm a Jamaican. And Uno will give me the next half. Uh, are you guys in deal with that one? So if it's 5000 to go there, I will put down everything and I'm transparent. I will put everything down, show you how much it costs to go there. And you guys give me half of the money and then I take the next half. Because you're not going to let me not achieve my, my things on a timely basis. I'm a principalmatic person. I can tell you that. All right? JD and his wife discuss what choices um, should be made every time. Not a real bad man. <laughs> These guys, I can't believe this. Um, he just want to go grind in, in the club every night. Ooh, who, me? No, I am not. I am not in those things. Um, JD, you have, the, you have money. 
you're one of the first man drive convertible beamer in Jamaica. Well, it in have the in have the problem. It, that was my family things. That was my family things. All of those convertibles and Range Rover was my family things. <laughs> no. I have to be responsible because I am one working for that damn thing. All right? Me and my lady working for those things. So I am not going to come and give it up on YouTube. All right? So if it's 5,000 and because, you know, say me, me and a Jamaican, I will take up 2,000 and spend and only pay the next 2,000. All right? Yes. <laughs> JD, take the family to Canada instead, bro. Uh, I am late. Who are the players missing? Antonio, um, join the list of missing players. You get me? JD, you are a part of the mafia. <laughs> Mr. Sponsor me to for a trip. All right. Look, Omzo. Look, look how life funny. Look how life funny. Omzo, don't you hear people on my, um, people for, for 80 begging me to go to 80 games. They will pay for it. And I said, I can't. For Nigeria, they would pay for it. And I said, I can't because of my, my all my life structured. I can't just leave my kid like that. It's not going to work, you know? And she never really went to any crush before in her life as to how we have uh, uh, set up things. My work time and my lady work time is always different. So one of us can stay home or our grandparents keep her. So from she's two, from she passed two years old and ready to go to school, she never really go back to crush, crush and stuff, all right? Yeah, so all I'm saying, people, um, every other country wanted to pay for me to go support their national team. The passion that I um, do exude um, to, towards the overall situation. And you guys now want me to pay all of my 7,000 to watch Jamaica when you tell me I'm not even a real Jamaican. So all you do is just broke me, you know, me give away a bag of money here, always. I waste my time and night time when I'm going to get more sleep for them to make more money and not stumble and drop off of, of a people machine and dead. Uh, and then now, so I don't know, what, what, I don't know why, me even support, why me even come on YouTube because all, you know, everything I me have to pay for and everybody else get free labor. <laughs> everybody else make, make money and me have to pay for everything. No, 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 no I got me, you know, I don't need it, you know. You know, everything you want to you know, call me. You know, and then tell me say me a real Jamaican. <laughs> um, that's it. Uh, that is it. Um, JD, America is not better. Uh, what's what's that have to do with us? Okay, I'm telling you, other people appreciate my my hard work and want to support me, but the Jamaicans they want to break me a little bit more. All right, yes. <laughs> Um, take care of yourself and your family, JD. Yeah, man. Um, I am not going to, um, JD not committed like certain players. Well, tell you what. One thing I do know, Brindrian, um, at least I, I, I might not commit myself in flesh, but when it comes down to donating and spending money, um, in, in helping Jamaica, Football, I, I don't think much people can match me in this space. If uh, maybe only one, but I don't, I don't even think so. I think I don't even think none because other people had to group up to do half of what I've done. So I'm almost certain that I am the top donator in this space when it comes on to helping Jamaica um, teams and Jamaicans overall in football, in their own Jamaica football and everything. So it, I don't need to be there for you guys to say that I'm not committed. All right? I don't have to be there for you guys to say that I'm not committed. All right? Check my track record, people. Don't let them fool, you know? None of them can walk not even 10% of what I've done. And I will continue to do. I don't have to turn up in per person because I need to stay here and continue working to spend the money. <laughs> if I don't work the money, or, or am I going to pay the money? All right? Or am I going to have more money to do more things? <laughs> Uncle Jay networking around um, 29 million. Oh my God! <laughs> Are you calling other um, people groupies? No, I'm just saying other people at the group to do what I have done. But yet still, I get I've got no respect because I need to just act like you know you know I'm just done. I'm just giving up on you guys. I'm I'm telling you I'm gonna just give up on all I only one day, you know, man. <laughs> 
Um, um, Stefan, I've not called anybody groupie. Oh my God. <laughs> Winston JD, the, the man, them curse you until you know surrender them. Let's talk somebody. Yeah, man, I'm just done with them. <laughs> um, 11 a.m. AM meeting. All right, big up yourself, um, Brindrin. Later, we will link up. I've gone around 20 minutes over the time. All right, hi, room. Hope all is well with you and your family. Yes, man. So, thanks yet again for another amazing one, people. Yeah, man, everyone check in um, in this one. Um, and we respect that. All right, so Michael Antonio will be out. So, let's see who is going to replace him and how that will turn out. But uh, we have to be here and report the thing and keep on um, trying to support um, the overall team. So, bye bye. Take care. We'll see you in the next one.